Uh, this is some thing. Exactly. <laughs> question. 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 Uh. uh All right, here it comes. What? This sucks. What? Bandicoot. <laughs> glass, really? Glass Bandicoot. <laughs> is, is, that what, is, glass. That what, is that what time is made out of in this world? It's 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 just made of a thin glass pane. Yeah, and Crash breaks right through it and slices up all his knuckles. Unlike the real world where time is made of slime. Yeah. Have set himself on fire. <laughs> was was there an old Cortex? Or he was just he was always Neo Cortex, right? Yeah. Oldo Cortex is my father. <laughs> I am acting Stop like it. back there. <laughs> he acts like a baby around other adults. That's respectable. At least who Oh, they can't count. He's like one of those people that's like, I used to pretend I was cool around you, but now I'm just being myself. <laughs> That's a good kind of reason for him turning this... into this absolute loser. <laughs> and you chose an idiot. That's your true self. <laughs> it's me animating. Yeah, how come the main villain is the least intimidating? Because he's a goof. He used to scare kids. I'm not kidding. Oh, yeah, that's right. They made him goofier because he was too scary. Yeah, he oh, used to be cool, and now he's just a loser. He's kind of a character like uh, like Eggman, right? Where at the end of every Crash Bandicoot, he kind of goes, I did a whoopsie! Please kinda. help! Yeah. Yeah. Well, at the end of 3, he does that. But this is 4. It's about time. A great power. Uh, I wish my plank would do that. <laughs> yeah, my plank just gives me splinters. <laughs> Crash, I am in constant pain. Crash, please, put me out of my misery. No board should be alive. <laughs> I'm bored. Whoa. No board should be alive. I'm bored of being alive. Ah, my board must die. Oh. Oh, are you in game? This is like old times. The classic blue goo. Some refer to it as... Gross. Yeah, isn't that wasn't that uh, Crash's nickname, the Blue Goo? Yep. <laughs> Look, Spyro, the Blue Goober. Oh yeah. Rock canceled. 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 <laughs> Rocking the sombrero. <laughs> Why you cancel just for wearing a sombrero? It's appropriating a sombrero. Because he's from Australia. Whoa. That's Wait, kinda... did it actually change the channel? Oh, it's yeah, all the different Crash games. He plays games Whoa. about himself. What a fucking weirdo. That's not a game. Cut to woman getting f***ed up her pussy. <laughs> Put that in, editor. Oh, <laughs> my fucking Ferrero. <laughs> wow, this feels great. This feels amazing. And the little... Uh, I'm glad that they gave you the option to turn off that little yellow circle in the full game. Yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> like your one big thing that you bitched about. And now bitch. you have no excuses. I'm not a bitch. You moaned, you <laughs> pissed, you shat. You definitely pissed. You farted. You definitely wailed and pissed. Are you calling me a pissing baby man? You wailed, you squailed. Because I'm not. You railed. Oh! <laughs> I was hoping he'd get his nuts squashed you between them. You were cleaved by those stone donuts. Have you seen the picture They're of the called... squirrel who fell down the fence and his nuts got stuck in it? Wait, literally? Yeah, he's hanging upside down by his nuts and he died in pain. That's terrible. <laughs> I know, it's really evil. Whoever, like, God planned out this horrible life for that squirrel. I don't know. So, Squirrel, squirrels can definitely be pests. Maybe the person who recorded and reveled in that had his reasons. Did he set it as a trap for the squirrel so that no. that would happen? It's, um, imagine, like, uh, the top of a fence is a bunch of these, like, little, uh, semicircles. Your words are whisking me away to this world, yes. See that? Yeah. And then the, the, the squirrel fell down, and his nuts got caught at the bottom of the semicircle, so it's like a perfect V-shape. Ooh. And then he's just hanging upside down, he couldn't and get out of it. And gravity was keeping him from removing his dongus from the dangle. That old bastard gravity at it again. <laughs> oh, look at that. My one true foe. He sure does blow. I love gravity. Oh, uh, oh uh, shoot! Oh, I, I forgot you had, you had an Aku. Does Whoa. Aku die every time you do that and then have to be born anew? Uh, I mean, he's just a wooden board, but yes. He's just simply a game mechanic in this universe. Is he friends with you? 
Yeah, he's part of the story. Does he only talk to Crash when he's in danger, or does he, like, hang out with him at other times, too? Yeah, like, if, do they play, like, paddle ball together at the beach? He hangs out with Crash as Stranger Danger. Hmm. Crash foolishly talks to him. Whoa. All right. He says, Crash, tell me when your mom isn't home. What <laughs> are you wearing? Nothing on top. Crash is only legal in parts of Asia and Amsterdam. <laughs> you did not make the, cra the classic crystal sound. Oh, the crystal sound. You're not I that I thought talented. you meant me going, oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I haven't heard a single Crash meme yet. This sucks. Do you think they pulled Woe out and it's all your fault? Nah. I mean, I don't know. Do you think that the lead developer of this game pulled his nipples out of his body <laughs> and it's all your fault? That I'll believe. Oh He's shit. You can double jump after the apex of the jump now. Could Wait, you oh, you just it? ran past what looked like a Relax, bonus. Relax, dude, I wanted the fucking apple. Oh, yeah, shit. just chill, man. Aren't they apples. mangoes? Tomar, hold your hand out in front of your face. Can you keep it still right now, you fucking nut? Yeah, uh, can you fucking relax? Uh, I'm trying to have fun. This is I like... can't, guys. <laughs> Stop shaking. Stop. Stop it. <laughs> this, this is a really important moment for me. It's true. This is, the, this is me reliving something that I grew up with. Do you feel like a child? No, I feel like... My back hurts. Oh, he's got a body pillow of his ex-girlfriend. That's you, you said actually you've been repulsive. Feeling better did he really? Got... Yeah, he did. What the fuck? Wait, what? Come back to that. <laughs> Examine. What did you say about a body pillow? He had a body pillow of Tana, apparently. Yeah. Oh. Didn't she? Didn't she? Uh, run off to get jackhammered by Tiny Tiger? Pinstripe. <laughs> Pinstripe. If it was Tiny Tiger, I'd kill myself if I was Crash. Really? I, I think Pinstripe has that little, like, weaselly no-neck fucking, like, I, at least with Tiny Tiger, it's like, okay, he put in the work, he went to the gym. No, with Tiny Tiger, you'd be like, I could never compete with that, but with Pinstripe, you'd be like, you left me for this fucking creep, fuck you, you're yeah, a bitch, that, and you're yeah, stupid. That's what I, that, isn't that more insulting? Yeah. It is more insulting, but it would make you hate her faster, so you're, like, if it's Tiny Tiger, you'd be like, wow, I'm very actually Insecure and he deserves to fucking cuck me. Whoa, <laughs> is, shit. is that how I would be? <laughs> Crash would. <laughs> but Pinstripe, you're like, fuck you, you fucking bitch. I don't need you. I honestly can't, like, I mostly know these characters from the time we played Crash Team Racing, so I can't remember which one's Pinstripe. Pinstripe is the bomb weasel. Wow. Have you gotten every box thus far? I don't know. It feels like oh it. Oh my god! Oh! <gasps> you did! Yay! You did! Wow, a rare jewel! <laughs> Tomar Emerald. <laughs> Stop laughing, you little whacker. Wait, what was that little hidden shit they had on the side there? Oh, you would like to know. Oh, that's, that didn't look like it was quite shaped like a dot. Is there like a super hidden gem on each level? Yeah, apparently. Man. That's <laughs> the only thing between you and being a chicken, apparently. Oh, this, this fucking. This rocks. Does it rock sore your sock sore? I really feel it like this is the his spiritual socks. successor. I am rockling in my socklings. Ew. Wow. Who carved a big cool skull here? Cause props, man. An absolute fucking idiot. More An absolute legend. <laughs> An absolute fucking legend. legend. Ah! Why are the natives always assholes? Uh, cause you invaded their land. You fucking scratched your belly and set up couches across all of them. I actually do miss the natives from the first game, the Papu Papu people. Ow. Is that what they're called? The Papu Papu people? No, that's what the main guy's called. Ooh, you got a Papu golden Papu. wumpa. Thanks, Tomar. That's right, they're not mangoes, they are called wumpa fruits. Yeah. Oh. I've been calling them mangoes this whole time. I freaking said that earlier. I, I totally missed it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't hurt me, you big fucking brute. Haha, uh -huh. okay. That guy's gonna throw up and then die. Whoa. This feels pretty good to control. I'm glad that that ghost rat knew to open that door for you. Ghost rat? Yeah, it was a ghost rat. That kind of reminds <laughs> me of your famous novel, Ghost Rat. <laughs> ghost rat. <laughs> Now you squeak it, now you don't. Uh, I'd read the fuck out of that. <laughs> ghost rat? Yeah. Oh yeah, there's the ghost rat. Where? I, He's on the left. That's you guys rat. need to watch for your ghost Ooh. rats more often, man. I, like, one, I, I honestly didn't know what you were talking about, but now I do. One could sneak right up on you. Whoa. 
Oh, oh shit! Fuck, no, oh, no! Oh, you were doing really good! I was. First. First. Oh, you're in Ghost Rat Junction anyway. Don't worry, okay. everything's alright. Yeah. Welcome to Ghost Rat Junction! <laughs> If you saw a ghost, would you be scared even if it was something stupid? Would I say something stupid? No, would you be scared of it? Like if it was like a ghost of like a, I don't know, a centipede or something. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Uh, you really the ghost yourself would, Yes, out. of course you'd be fucking scared. You'd be like, is that thing radioactive? Is it real? Am I going crazy? Yeah, why is that, why is that red, blue, and transparent? What, what if it was a ghost of a pill bug? That would be fucking stupid. Yeah, so you wouldn't be scared of it? Even if it was a ghost? I'd be scared. I'd, that would that would open up a whole new world of possibilities. Like heaven's real, maybe. Okay, what if it was a it ghost? It would give you something to look forward to, you know, like seeing your grandparents and stuff. Dude, that fucking bounce fucked me so bad. Okay, we're yeah. good. Yeah. Yeah. Ghost spider would be scary. Ah, uh, don't seize him. He has sentience. He has rights. He can sue you. I would never hold him. How come he didn't die from that? It was clearly a large fall with a concrete end. Whoa. Lanny Loli. I love lollies. <laughs> I love Lanny Loli. <laughs> Crash loves lollies. You heard it here oh, first. Oh, you just ran past the Christie. <laughs> Good Gemini, Tomar. <laughs> Tomar, you're so freaking good at finding those! Tomar... I didn't find the one on the first level. You should call yourself the Gemi Gemini. And that could be your new YouTube channel the where Gemi you... The Gemi to Gemini. Yeah. I'm not even a Gemini, I think I'm a Pisces. Who cares, dude? It's all <laughs> bullshit anyway. I know, but apparently it's sexist to say that Whoa. now. Wait, is it sexist? To... I don't know, but I've heard, I've heard that take before at least. That really? it's sexist that to it's think sexist horoscopes are dumb? That, that men disparaging horoscopes is somehow sexist towards women Oh, no, women I think it's actually in... fucking awesome. <laughs> it's very weird the people that will be like, I'm not religious, and then they'll fucking, they'll believe that shit. Yeah, they'll girls think will make fun of, and... like, Christianity and fucking all that shit. Horoscopes are cool, though. No, fuck you, bitch. Fuck like if you're you. Gonna, you if you're and everybody else them. with the same birth month as you really has the same fucking set of circumstances. You, oh, why did that not break? Oh, fuck man. you. He got you with his big masculine jaw. He knew, he you, were, he knew you were being a completionist, too. Don't forget the gym. He was like, I'm an Ophiuchus, and I'm mad <laughs> at you for saying that. Oh, no, wait. I guess that was before the checkpoint. No crash. You dickhead! Yeah, you got it. You got it. You got it. Did he? Yeah. yeah. Or did the thing smash it? I'm never gonna get these though. You got him, you got He doesn't fucking- no, you got him, you got him, you got him, you got him. Ah! Make the spinning hitbox bigger or I'll delete this from my PlayStation! <laughs> <laughs> I will write an angry letter! Uh, Paragraph uh, indent! I recently- You dick! You got it, you got it, you slide, got it, slide, slide, slide! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Ooh, another oh. one. Blah, 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 oh, blah, blah, blah. man. I saw that last one, Tomar, for the record. Oh. oh, you can't die that many times. Oh man, that was just for dying. Oh. <gasps> That's okay. It gives you a reason to replay the levels, I guess, but we're not gonna do that here because fuck you. You don't want to watch that. Nope. No. That's something you do on your own time. No, no, no way. Not in a million years. Goodbye, Lanny Loli. <laughs> That stupid floating mask didn't even try. These kids always on the iPad! Who's that? Invader Zim. I thought you went to jail! <laughs> <laughs> I ratted some people out! <laughs> <laughs> it's just art, man! I wanna fuck Crash's map. Oh, never mind. He stopped. We keep shut. We have to go through. Find my siblings and fix this before some putz with a big evil plan and a bigger ego does something monumentally stupid. I think they're talking about that guy. I just don't know. <laughs> I like his facial expressions. No, the animation is all like, it's very pro level. I really believed he had an itchy bum when he did that. I could feel it. <laughs> I hate this Cortex. Why do you hate him? He's a complete asshole. He's a dunce. I liked him better when he was like, I like killing animals with this machete. <laughs> with this machete. Now he's like, I like killing animals with stupid pillows and <laughs> inflatable hammers. Hasten your steps. 
Oh, they made engines sound better. That's good. I don't remember what he used to sound like. I feel like there was a period when they just kind of gave up on his filter, but now it's back in full force. What do you mean they gave up? Like it was hard? No, like, you know... They the, stopped applying it? They have a filter on them where... Uh, it's like it's the demon filter. It, it it decreases four semitones or increases four semitones and it makes them sound a little scary. And it's layered. Uh, I'm impressed that you know what it, like, I know that you can recognize what a semitone is. I I cannot. It's just a note. It's just one little note. Ba ba. That's a semitone. Everyone's just one. I guess little both of you guys or... definitely have more of a musical ear than I would. I'm definitely an expert in music and I know everything there is to know about it. I grew two inches when I heard music for the first time. <laughs> I mean, maybe you did. There's Can't so much. Prove it. There's so much fucking shit to learn about with music. It's crazy. It, it really is just like uh, you never stop, which yeah. is one of the cool things about it. And I feel like everybody fills in their knowledge differently. So even if you're like hanging out with somebody that you've studied it or done stuff with it for way longer they know totally different shit from you it's kind of cool yeah i got a friend called miron he's fucking awesome he was telling me all this cool new shit i never know oh, check yeah. out miron he's fucking crazy how do you spell miron <laughs> m-i-r-r-o-n check out crazy miron he's a fucking psycho Oh, don't look him in the eye. Don't look him in the eye, but check him out. <laughs> he made that Guptill song I showed you recently. Oh, that was really good. Yeah. Also, Coco sounds like she's in a bathroom or something. Yeah. It's maybe she was. Yeah, like COVID. so much stuff was recorded at home for COVID. Ooh, you I never really think. know how any, any games that are coming out past this next like few months are going to have been made. Yeah, Lyle, maybe fucking think about that next time before you besmeet her. That, besmeet? I'm just saying, that might literally be what's going on, is we're hearing the sound of some poor actress's, like, Some poor like, fucking closet. bitch, yeah. Yeah, some, some impoverished actress. Not poor, Please. like, that kind of some poor. Some dying woman. Just, Fuck! like, poor as in, like, she did not have the opportunity to have engineers, like, make her sound perfect. Please donate to her GoFundMe. Oh. She is panhandling. She's handling her bedpan. She, yeah, she's become incontinent. She's becoming a continent. <laughs> she's become the continent of Malaysia. <laughs> it's not a continent. Oh, it's well, a, wouldn't it's you know, Mr. Geography? I'm sorry, I learned what a semitone was and grew two inches. There's you learned... Europe, Asia, and Malaysia. Yeah, you, Everyone knows. You learned what a continent was and got five inches shorter. And you <laughs> won't let me forget it. Donate also to Tomar's... Uh, in bigoting fund. fund. Yeah, his in bigoting fund. Whew. That fucking scared me! That was a good play, though. You handled it like a Kick champ. Kick the can! Fuck, Fuck you, yeah. little bastard. Woo! You gotta see Willy. <laughs> oh, wait, no. That's not funny. It well, has nothing to do with C. He's sand, you dickhead. No, the letter C. Fuck you. You failed. Why is he called C. Willy? <laughs> yeah, dickhead. Explain. Was, uh, no. <laughs> I don't know you anything. <laughs> Oh, I was trying to yeah, time it. They, I don't think that those two dimensions ever interact. That makes me sad. Uh, well, you just wait until the merge happens. Oh, yeah, the dimensional merge upcoming. I always forget about that. Yeah, you would. Dude, this is fucking crazy shit happening. Holy moly. Dude, this is nuts. Did you see that fucking uh, rodent back there? This is absolutely bonkers, isn't it, mate? Oh, I fucking love fucking rodents and stuff. This is well good. Oh, no, it... it's got, this is going to be hard. Oh, <laughs> so am I. <laughs> Nothing gets me more riled. Uh, <laughs> Dude, you rock at this. Look at me go, Lo. Holy shit. Oh. Yeah. Oh, the... oh the... no. no. I think that was the one you missed last time. This is oh. pure stress. I did yes, it. Yes, checkpoint. I did it! Slap the tint and then get the hell out of there. I'm gonna stand at a safe distance. Yeah. Okay. You oh way. no, what's that up there? Where? Wait, hit that. What? What? Uh, there, there was like a box up there, I thought. Maybe was there wrong. really? I have no idea. Like, jump. Oh! oh. <laughs> no! What a bummer. I hate it when I'm right. At least it's right after the checkpoint. Okay, as long as you don't get any more deaths, you can Fuck. still get that diamond. You no, know I'm gonna die. Fuck. It's called a livemind if you live through it. Yes! Oh! There's so much uh, hidden crates in this one. 
I think there was one hidden crate in all of two. There's, there's how many? One. Wow. Why won't they just tell us? And everyone hated it. Everyone? Yeah. Everybody agreed. It was the worst hidden crate. I'm gonna look up YouTube think piece hidden crate crash bandicoot. And I see bet you'll it. find an essay about it. Let's see. I'm gonna I'm gonna actually look. Crash oh God. Okay. This is bandicoot. Be Don't hidden. Oh, oh my God. Let's oh. See hidden boxes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. There's no there's no way that's helpful. No. No. Oh. This is so scary. Oh, shut up, you Swing left! Fuck you right! Oh. oh my god. Alright, if I look up Hidden Boxes Crash Bandicoot uh, video essay, I got Crash Bandicoot oh. and Icon oh. Decline. Oh my god, you got it! Yeah, You got a Crash Bandicoot and what? Bonus an Icon time. Decline. So yeah, this guy... This he guy was, knows. He kinda is an Icon in Decline. Do you guys want to start lying about when we're recording uh, episodes and start predicting world events? Yeah. Oh, dude, I dreamt about nukes last night. I got real scared. You dreamt oh, about nukes? I woke up with my heart fucking pounding out of my chest. I couldn't breathe when I woke up. I was so scared. Yeah, I dreamt that me, Zach, and Tomar were sitting in, our, in my backyard because we, we had been that night. And then I, I dreamt that these missiles started flying by in the sky. Damn it. Oh, no, no. You no, got no, 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 no. Oh, fuck. I didn't see it. That was right there. No, there, there was, was a, a ghost, ghost up thing. box. Kill me. Just kill me. Maybe we're... if the nukes... I, I hope they come now. <laughs> but, dude, that, that dream was scary because these nukes were flying by. And we're all like, what the fuck? Are those nukes? And we're, like, looking back and forth at each other. And then uh, there's just, like, a big fucking light over the mountain. And we're like, fuck! There's a fucking nuke! And then uh, these, uh, you know, these other missiles started going by. And they looked like strobe lights. And they blinded me. And then I woke up. <laughs> I was really scared. Did you pee? Nah. Uh, I, then you weren't really scared. I only Dude, pee when really I need to pee. Really scary dreams make you pee, dog. Uh, sorry, I don't pee unless necessary. Oh, fuck, I forgot. <laughs> sorry, I don't pee unless necessary. <laughs> oh, no! I forgot. Dude, I wish they were a little more apparent with those blue particles, cause my eyes not my 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 eyesight's not that good. Yeah, well, they make video games for the youngs, not for the olds, Chris. I'm Step young, aside. Actually, wouldn't the youngs say things like "Crash Bandicoot too hard, Crash Bandicoot evil"? Oh wait, that <laughs> other that other one to the left didn't get blown up. Are you fucking serious? I think you could still get it. Uh, yeah, you totally get it. Son of a bitch. See, I caught it. We are just pissing in Chris's cornflakes because we want him to be better. I'm better. It's yeah. true. We do it for him. <laughs> it's in another realm, and I don't care. Oh, f I care about that one though. Oh. Oh God! Oh, oh no! <laughs> that right. went way too fast. Now Holy give shit. them the body slam a jammas. Okay. Okay. Now uh, body slam. You can that. slam the whole thing, yeah. But I'm scared. It'll be fine. Fuck. <laughs> Woo. Okay. And I got the big fruit. You're a big fruit. Uh, Boom, got yeah, you. Cancelled. Uh, Only 42 left. Cancelled, cancelled, cancelled. I'm saying that you're full of seed. <laughs> Wait, is that why that's a thing? That's also... <laughs> that's a really good point. <laughs> full of seed. Oh, look, there's a thing. They're young, dumb, and full of seed. What the hell? Why did that not go fucking higher? There's, there's a there, thing up there. You think there's a thing above that wumpa fruit? Wumpa fruit? It really feels like it. Maybe you what? Oh god, there is! Maybe How you go around there? in a circle. Well, it's mm. you either try again and give up the uh, the what's it called? Well, the fuck, the, the shark. three the three deaths thing, or yeah, yeah, just wait for him to go again. Oh my god! Whoa, oh, that got me. That was close. Who's this little fucking ass? Okay. Whoa! Yeah, I thought the shark <laughs> came out of the crate the for a second. Hurry up, you big fucking ass! You got this. Yeah. Oh, oopsie. It's okay though. There's something funny about here in Richard Horvitz do that like how would you get him? Oh, oh I thought that there's was There's your fourth death. All right. <gasps> no! I'm a real fucking idiot. That's okay. It makes us feel better. Yeah, how come no comments ever say nice things like that? Yeah. I did this way better than him and that means that I'm smart. Yeah. That's what you should be thinking. <laughs> if the pope Personally, it was like, 
Tomar, I will give you one handshake. Yeah, Personally, is, 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 I is, will is, come to your house and the... hang out with you. <laughs> Would you would you become Catholic to hang out with the Pope if he said I, wait I'll, I have to convert yeah uh, but he said I'll hang out with you I'll buy you lunch we can talk about whatever you want would you convert no it's <laughs> a once in a lifetime opportunity I would, I would love for a chance to hang out with the Pope uh, like there's something very special about that but not not if it meant I had to like falsely proclaim a religion I didn't believe yeah, in you could you could do some taxi driver shit where you like prepare for the Pope. And get him involved in some huge scheme, or you could just like say all the things you've ever, you've always wanted to say to the Pope, like the Pope, more like the Pope. I just like I could be dishonest and just like say, yeah, sure, I'll convert because it doesn't mean anything to me. But I don't know, that just that feels wrong. I don't think I would I would become a Catholic just to hang out with the Pope. The Pope calls you every Saturday to to con confirm that you're still Catholic afterwards. Is th does that still count as confirmation? I, that's a stupid joke. Cut that out. <laughs> Wait, what? Was that but a even, thing? Confirmation is a big thing with Catholics. It's like it their is. version of like a bar mitzvah. I did it. Yeah, see, even Chris is confirmed. Yep. What if, what if the the Pope said, okay, I'll come to your house and I'll put a wedding cake in my hat and we can eat the whole thing, just you and me? I'd run up really, really fast and say, hey, replace your P with an N. The no. <laughs> the no. <laughs> yeah. Or, or the pwn. The pony. <laughs> or the nun. What if the Pope became a pony? Do you guys want to sign up for Tinder and use pictures of the Pope and just pretend to be the Pope and see if anybody, uh, anybody fucks us? That'd be like the guy who, uh, uses fake pictures. I feel like that's a lot pictures. more likely to wind up on Twitter before anyone actually, like, takes the bait. What yeah. if we get, like, a really big trench coat, we all stand on each other's shoulders and show up to the date and be like, it's us, the Pope! Like a little rascal's Pope scheme? <laughs> yeah. And then I they'll would. be like, well, you are really tall. You, sh yeah, I guess you are a pope. I would just, uh... I oh, don't know, have you seen that guy on Tinder? There's a video of him on YouTube where he, he puts, like, really cool-looking chads as his profile, and he, and he gets really mad that girls want to go on dates with the chads, and then he shows up and berates the girls. He's what like, a turd! And he's yeah, like, that's, 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 a, that's a pretty, like... Yeah, he's a like a pretty lame move. He's like, all you care about is good looks. It's like, dude, that's why you picked the girl to start with. What yeah, the fuck what are you we, talking about? No, that that that's definitely been a common like theme that that I think is very real. Is that weird like double standard thing all these like angry incel type guys have? Yeah, and you're allowed to like hot girls, and they're allowed Just like to not like you back. Yeah, they're allowed to like hot guys. Yep. Or or conventionally hot guys, I should say, to be a little more politically correct. I will say, I uh, I used to live in like a windowless garage that you had to walk through like a weird, <laughs> creepy alley to get to. Oopsie. And there there were a few times where I was like, I mean, I didn't say it out loud, but I was I was like kind of silently thinking like, what? aren't you at least a little bit afraid I'm a serial killer? To who? To just women. <laughs> Why would you say that? I didn't say I it. I mean, look at me. I just thought it. <laughs> Although, to be fair, like, part of my game was, like, Beat joking him. around about <laughs> living in a creepy, uh, like, fucking, like, windowless garage. So, by the time that came into play, it was usually like, ooh, I want to see it. So, like, I, I kind of used it to my advantage, but... Yeah, Want to check I, out my creepy windowless garage? Well, did that change your personality at all? Living in a garage for like three or four years? Living in a garage with no window? I mean, probably, right? It, it's hard to say what did six that fuck years. You up? What six years anywhere does to a person? Was it six years? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Six years of rats. Six years of rats and y yeah, I, I really actually don't delve into that too much. Uh, I, I lived in what was essentially like a big concrete box. You've mentioned it before. Uh, it was basically like a duplex, and my uh, my landlord Fuck was this. like, he was We're like a skip it all. <laughs> he was like a Vietnam vet that was probably had some sort of like severe undiagnosed yeah, PTSD because the dude was nuts. <laughs> yeah, and. Uh, yeah, we there were just hijinks that ensued. <laughs> mountains upon mountains of hijinks. Of rat slam and hijinks. Rat slam and hijinks. Rat slam and hijinks. I, ha I have a restraining order against his crazy ex-wife because she kept like coming back and you threatening do? to. Yeah, I do. You got a restraining order? Yeah. Wow. Like he got it against her. Like she can't come near him. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, I know. Okay. But I've never, I never knew you had to do that. No, it was, it was like a whole fucking thing. What the fuck? You never told me this shit. Oh no. Uh, jeez, is that? Let me see if that's. It, let me think about if that's a story I want to tell on Only Plays. <laughs> that's fair. It, Take it's, your time. 
You, okay, you know what? Fuck it. So basically, like, my, my landlord had this crazy ex-wife. Like, when I say ex-wife, she was like an ex-wife at the time that he let move back in with oh. him. Because she got, like, kicked out of, like, her daughter's house or something. Yeah. That's, so, al that's always a good reason to let someone move in with you. So she was she was fine for a bit. But when she would drink, it was like night and day psycho shit. <laughs> and after, and he was pretty hard to deal with too. So I'm sure that like he probably pushed her buttons to a certain extent. But like, there was a point where every single like they had no hours. It could be like night or day. Yeah. So there was a point where they were fucking screaming at each other like probably three to four hours a day. Fuck. So there was like an extended period of time where I was getting like. When I say no sleep, I mean, like, I would probably get, at most, like, two hours of sleep a I night. I would blow my brain. What, yeah, what did you try to deal with that? You tried, I'm sure you tried, like, like earplugs and, yeah, no, and just, drowning it, it out but and it stuff. But was, it was just fucking, like, screaming constantly. So, eventually, like, he cut her off from alcohol, and she got so desperate that, like, she signed, like, a cash for keys agreement. He was trying to get rid of her for, like, a year, maybe. Wow. And then when he got rid of her, of course, that night... She started coming back, and we changed the locks on like everything. Mm -hmm. So she was basically like just standing outside the uh, the building, outside the gate, like screaming that she was gonna kill us for like hours at a time every single night. What the fuck? And it was like that's horrifying. Just yeah, I mean, I, I guess I have... it, all it took was one recording and to get to get a judge to give you a restraining order. Yeah, did you I record mean, her? I um I didn't record any of that. Well, I I might have, but I don't have it anymore. I do have like. Tons of fucking I, I recorded all the messages she left on his fucking answering machine and there's there's some gold mine shit in there uh, Monica calls her Cherokee Patty but because there's Cherokee a, Patty. because there's there's this like incoherent voicemail where she's like ah, fuck it, this is that and, the other. <laughs> and she ends it with like and I'll tell you what oh fuck I'm, I'm more fucking, fucking Cherokee than, than you'll, you'll ever be, be. <laughs> and I mean that. Why would she say that? I don't know. Dude, it's like incoherent, like, rambling. Like, she literally sounds like the fucking cat lady from The Simpsons. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that but, Trace McNeil, like, crazy lady scream she does. Yeah. Like, there's psycho shit. She was, like, trying to, to, like, she kept telling the cops that she had, like, heart medicine that she needed to go inside and get. Because, like, she, in her oh, mind, if she sake. got to the other side of the gate, he wouldn't be able to kick her out again. Which mm -hmm. he might not have, because it took him so long to get rid of her the first time. But that's that's Fuck. why I have oh, a no. restraining order against her, was just so that, like, if she showed up, we could call the cops and they could get her to leave. Because they were, like, super not fucking helpful. Really? Like, yeah. If, if you... Dude, if you have a situation with the cops... And you're God. dealing with something like an old lady, mm -hmm. you know, like, or, or or just anywhere where it's like you're like a like a full grown man, and then the other person looks like more helpless. Dude, the cops let them fucking walk all over you. Wow. They let her dri drive away like so goddamn drunk that uh, there was like a person on a bike, and she almost like hit the person on the bike. The the cop had to like scream at her. And then she like peeled away and, they and like still just let her go, Yeah, they huh? just let her go. Wow. She was so goddamn like belligerent drunk. Like I mean like barely able to like stand up like slurring her words like crazy drunk and the cop let her drive away. It was fucking nuts. I realized she had to go when one time they were like having this huge fight. I came home. They were having this huge fight and he was like out front in his underwear and she was just screaming at him from the window. I like went into the backyard and my fucking dog was missing. Is this an Your optional dog? level? My dog. You and had I was a dog? Like, I, yeah. Oh. And I was like, where the fuck is my dog? And she had like barricaded my, she had like stolen my dog and like wow. had my dog like locked up there with her. What the and it was, fuck? I was like, this bitch has got to fucking go. And then when, when, you know, when she was outside the gate screaming every night, then she really let me know what she thinks, cause uh, she was like, "My son should be where he, should be living where you are." And, and like there were all these all these voicemails where like, y "You don't know, but I know that Lyle is a fucking f <laughs> like things like that." In, in her mind, we were we were doing cocaine uh. with whores, and she was gonna tell the cops everything. It was fucking psycho shit. It was nuts. This level but, is fucking psycho <clears throat> shit. But yeah. I'm impressed at how well you're dealing with this. Look, you're gonna get it. You're, you're really what gonna get fuck? it. What the fuck? Holy shit. You did it! You monster. That was not fun. 
but it was fun to win, wasn't it? But no. yeah, that <laughs> that was just one of many sagas in uh, in that fucking concrete hell. <laughs> I'm sorry that happened, Lyle. It's fine. God, that's the worst fucking shit ever. I'm sorry. But now you have a real nice place. I like your place. I do, yeah. It's super cool. Walks inside Lyle's place, smells the bacon. Mmm. <laughs> Lyle's cooking bacon with his top off, roasting his nipples with bacon grease splattering all over his burnt corpse. Hey, man, that's what gets the ladies. <laughs> but yeah, no, like, I don't think I came out of that place with any sort of, like, weird PTSD, but one I lasting would've. one lasting effect of it, just from not having windows for so long... Is that my my internal like clock is on like a 26 27 hour day yeah so if if I'm left to my own devices my sleep schedule will slide two to three hours ahead every single day That's because I bad. I've just completely lost track of like when the Sun is up and down from that I like how in our friend group uh, sleep schedules being out of sync is just very accepted whenever it happens Yep. That's true. You know what? I'm sure that more people are experiencing that now because of COVID and they're spending yeah. all that time yeah. inside. I, I I do not work my normal hours anymore. Like, I, I love waking up later and just working later. It's Nothing's changed for me. Yeah, it, it's something where well, uh, if you do it for long enough, you start to, like, not like it. You, you have to kind of go through periods of, like, forcing yourself into a schedule and then enjoying not being on a schedule. You know yeah. what I mean? Okay. What the heck? <laughs> oh, I mean, I... I uh... It sure looked like you just, like, fell behind that. Yeah. But I, I don't... There is depth to this, so maybe that ah! is what happened. There's depth to you, Tomar. You're a multifaceted little guy. I lived with these guys I in try college. I tried to be human. That was a very similar situation. Not that bad, obviously, but the guys I lived with, they were so fucking loud. They would just blast music all day, every day. And when was this? In college. Oh, I see. I didn't it, know you went to college. Yeah, I actually didn't either. I'm a bona fide dropout. Yeah, me too. I'm very fucking glad I did. Uh, I am too, but I'm, I'm, yeah, no, I'm not going to say everyone should drop out. I was going to say, I don't know if in my, in my situation... <laughs> Who knows how I would have fared without college. In my situation, I would have <laughs> completely fucked myself by staying there. But... Yeah, do not drop out of college to be a Let's Player. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, if Let's Playing happens to suddenly make you enough money to drop out of college, that's another story. Drop out of college but to even sue then, Let's Players. It's to sue... <laughs> I, I would I would in say, fact finish your JD so you can sue let's players all on your own. What's this? I, I would say like if you have like a promising career path that you're working on and you're in college and you don't need it to pursue that career path, then maybe think about it. Because it is a lot of money, yeah. No, it, especially in Ireland, it doesn't cost money to go to college. Oh, yeah, that's true. If you're in a place where college is like cheap to free. Totally, totally do it if you have anything you want to study. I mean, there's straight up some places that pay you to go to college. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that, like, what? Sweden does, or, or uh, Finland, or one of those. Well, that's just crazy. Hey, man. You get some some smart, um, I don't know what their accents sound like. You're such a fucking like. communist, Lyle. Hey, man. <laughs> if you go to school, you... I mean, I haven't seen the Swedes put any men in space, but okay. Uh, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Look, you, you build a big enough catapult, any country can get someone to space. If, you, <laughs> if you're not so worried about the technicalities. But yeah, the guys I live with were fucking rude assholes. Oh yeah, sorry, we didn't mean to cut no, you off. It's all, uh, that's pretty much all I have to say. Oh. They were what? really mean too. Fucking, uh, my toilet literally exploded in my room one day when I was away. And I got back and there was shit all over the floor. And I was like... Slide. I was like, can I sleep in one of your guys' rooms? And they were can like... you slide under that? Yeah, yeah. I was, I'm sorry, I was just telling the story. Oh, Jesus sorry. fucking Christ, Tomar. Sorry, sorry. Fucking I got all Christ, Tomar. Fuck this. But yeah, I was like, can I sleep in your room? There's shit all over the floor. And they were like, oh, okay. It's like, thanks, dude. <laughs> like, fucking thank you. Dude, when I was in college, there was this girl that lived in our, like, dorm thing. And I woke up one night, and she was literally on top of me. But, like, fucking, uh, just wake up. Just trying to like do shit. I'm like, uh, no. So he's still trying to do shit. No, can, I'm trying to sleep. And then she walks out into the kitchen with those two assholes, and they're like, "Did it work?" And, I'm, and she's like, "No, he's out of commission for tonight." It's like I don't fucking know you, lady. You should have fucking blasted pee in her eye. Wait, you're not gonna take the aku? I don't need. You got brass balls, kid. I don't want to use him as like the side character. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to like degrade him like that. I want him to have his own story. <laughs> That was still kind of ballsy not to take him. I don't need that fucking dweeb. Yeah. 
I love you, Engine. I love you. He sounds like a uh, fucking cut man okay, no, from. Uh, oh yeah, which is that's all just like a Hugh Laurie impression, right? I'll make paper dolls oh, out of you. Like, cut yeah. man here to take my cat. Oh, you do a real good one. <laughs> Cut man, who's Cut man? From from the Ruby Spears uh, Mega Man show. What? Oh. That show had such a fucking killer opening, and then the oh, actual yeah, I, show was whatever. Yeah, the but. opening got me so hyped that I didn't notice how bad the rest oh of the God. show was. Even to this day. <gasps> no, you dick! Oh! You fucking! <laughs> I thought that was another up arrow. Damn it! Take this, Mega Dork! Yeah, he. But yeah, it's just like a Hugh, a Hugh Laurie impression, you know. Look, boss, the plane, the plane. <laughs> Hugh Laurie, like the guy who plays House? <laughs> wait, no, wait, not Hugh. That's Peter Laurie, isn't it? Uh, or, no, Hugh Laurie no, is the guy. No, who maybe. Plays, okay, I'm thinking of Peter Laurie. Hugh Laurie is the I'm guy sorry, who plays I'm House and the dad and Stuart Little. You're right. <laughs> Hugh Laurie is House. I meant Stuart Peter Little. Laurie. <laughs> How did you even remember that shit? Because I fucking hate Stuart Little, man. How much? Oh god, I would, I would mash him with my fist if he was real. But he's, he's also Marty McFly. He's also supposedly a human being. Fuck what you! What was that? Fuck was you! Was there a nit nitrous there? Was, there? there was, but it was too late. I didn't even notice it, yeah. even when you hit it. Did you know that infuriating Stuart Little factoid is that Stuart Little isn't a mouse, he's a human? No, he's not. He's clearly a white fucking lab rat. Oh, uh, yeah. You would think that, but no. Stuart Little is a human being. The reason he's a lab rat <laughs> is because they experimented on him, gave him sentience, and then he fucking ran away. Wait, is that what happened? Yes. No. Yes. Isn't that also the basis of the Rats of Nim? And Pinky in the Brain. The Rats of Nim is a, is based on an actual real thing. Yeah, it actually is. Oh, you're, there actually was a place called the National Institute of Mental Health, or Nim. It's based on did, a real where, animator called Don Bluth, who's fucking scary and looks like a skeleton. Yeah, he keeps And they the animated rats. a whole movie just to show, that, to make up that, that he animated a movie, because he really <laughs> didn't. Also, look at that, it's Twitch. Wow. I fucking love Twitch. I love supporting my I'm favorite going streamers to with bits. later tonight. I love going to TwitchCon and being told about being an influencer. I'm going to dye my hair Wait. and fucking call everyone else horrible. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to pretend to be a deer and get rubbed I up. I just said that! <laughs> said Chris as he jumped into the electrified bar. Once again, Lyle rips me off. I fucking can't stand it anymore. I was trying to yes and you, you prick. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he jumps right into it. Fuck you, game. That's really mean. Also, the bars above it are kind of green and they blend into one yeah, continuous nice object. Lighting, lighting guy. Actually, this game has lovely lighting for the most part. I was gonna say, it's super cinematic lighting. He puts one light in the wrong Whoa. place and you bite the dude's head off. I just like just being don't mean. don't forget about that. Dang. No! If I hadn't a belly flopped, <laughs> yeah, you would have been fine. God, I suck at crash. Actually, I'm really good. If I say I'm really good, people will forget that I suck. Fuck you! I hate that. Oh, they give you the pity mask. I love it when they give you the uh. That shit is is the basis of like uh. What's his name again? Aku Aku and like all the like sort of tribal theme stuff. Is that based on like Aboriginal Australian culture? Because Crash is in Australia? You would think. Like, I, honest question. I have no idea. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It's based on pity, I think. Like they just felt bad for Crash, so they gave him a they gave him a friend. Get in the ball! Get in the ball! Get in the ball! Get in the ball! Oh, I'm in a fucking little ball and I'm having a fucking ball! Oh, ball me up, whoa! Oh, I love the way it's animated. Yeah, it's pretty good. Wow, you can jump, you can thump. What else can you do? You get your fucking ankle caught in one of those openings though and twist ah! it would hurt real bad. Yeah, then Battle Dome won't be so fun. Yeah, Crash thinks he's so fucking cool. That's the only Mad Max I saw before Fury Road was the the first one man enter. Oh, I mean, two Thunderdome. man enter, Th one Thunder man Dome or whatever. Yeah, I thought it was fun. Yeah, Thunderdome's fine. I've actually never seen Thunderdome. I've only seen the original Mad Max and Fury Road. Is the original one good? real weird. It's honestly weird because he doesn't really become Mad Max until the last scene of the movie. That's cool. It's like all just giving you all the reasons for him to be Mad Max. Like, he's like this very like happy dude living in the post-apocalypse with his family. Uh. And then these horrible people like kill, like destroy everything he has. And then he just like fucking goes, 
he loses his shit and becomes Mad Max, and that's the like climax of the movie. Yeah, that's they, cool. He's this guy in the apocalypse that can't get mad. And these guys want to prove to him that he can be just as mad as everybody else. Yeah, it's sort of like, uh, what's what's the biblical figure? Uh, Sam I Am. No, uh... Where he tries to get him to eat the green eggs The and one ham. where God was trying to prove that this guy believed in him, so, uh... What was it? Uh... Oh, the goat guy? Goat oh, Angroar. Yeah, Angroar, that was his name. <laughs> <laughs> no, I gotta remember this now or I'm gonna feel like a jackass. Uh, I know the guy you're talking about, the dude that God's like, kill your son, and then... No, then, that's Abraham. This no, is the that guy God... freed the slaves. No, no that's Stupid. Moses. Stupid. <laughs> Just because you're Jewish doesn't mean you... <laughs> I did study study the Torah and the Old Testament through all my childhood. Oh, yeah. is this the boss battle? The Civil War yeah. is a pretty sick Bible story, though. I'm not even religious, and I think it's pretty cool. The Civil War? Like Marvel Civil War? No. <laughs> like the U.S. Civil War? Yeah, with Abraham. Wait, what? You Where guys are just fucking <laughs> pissing everyone off. <laughs> this is supposed to be a let's play. Right, let's keep religion out of it. But what, no, but this is... Who is the guy that God picked we'll on We'll do a let's now? pray next time. Rocket head. Aw, oh, shit. He's gonna play painkiller. Oh, that's sick. Oh. Oh, Job. That's who I was thinking of. The Book of Job. Oh, the guy that you say things are by. By Job. Yeah. He, <laughs> he takes credit for everyone else's work. Oh, love. I think he deserves it after all the mean stuff God did to him. Oh, oh I want to address something. Yeah. What? What's up? People in the comments say that we always ignore your jokes, but I always just like I'm not trying to. I just focus on the game and I don't hear them, and then I look back and then I laugh later. Well, I'm that, was a, that was a good one I caught. I'm sorry. Uh, you, you know, dude, just keep riffing. I don't, I don't mind. See? Ah! Yeah, but I mean, I gave, I gave Chris the the pass. Don't worry about it. You gave me the end pass. I can't give you that, but I can give yeah, you the confidence not, to say to it give. yourself. If you have a tribal tattoo, <laughs> what what pass can you give me? Um, I can give you the the having sex pass. I can uh, give you the, the POV having sex pass. POV having yeah. sex <laughs> Everyone uh, knows the POV uh, community is exclusively sporting tribal tattoos. I don't want to have sex. Well, I mean, you don't have to use it. I can just... Sex is stupid. I don't think I even need this stupid idiot. Look at that. Oh, yeah. wow. <laughs> You're cheating! You were supposed to switch the blue to the other thing! <laughs> switch the blue, become the oh. you! When you wish upon a star! Oh my god, this is scary. That's pretty cool. What is... Hey, you're, you're rocking it. You're beating their little Activision's nod to, uh, Rock Band boss. Rock Band boss? I don't, this feels like Rock Band or Guitar Hero, yeah, which are also Activision properties. Yeah, Were they? Kinda cool. Yeah, I think they so. bought it. It was. Yeah, they might not have started that way. Are those games still around? I feel like they're not. No, well, they, they that that got like fatigue. That yeah. whole music game, like rhythm game genre, got a ton of fatigue, and they just stopped. I feel oh, like fuck. they would work really well oh, now fuck. in the the Whoa. age of like free to play. Now stuff. you're just insisting on not using. <laughs> Uh, that kills you! Oh no! I'm stupid. I really La wanted to see if I La cheated. Lonnie Loli killed you. <laughs> Lale Lule Lo. How come that's such a fun thing to say? Lale Lule Lo? Yeah. It's probably why Kojima put it in his game. He just yeah. couldn't stop saying it. Lale Lule Lo. Lale Lule Lo. He was saying la 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 la. <laughs> la 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 la. <laughs> yeah, he was, he was XDing so hard that he just typed it on his keyboard. Wait, that's not Kojima. That's fucking Miyamoto. Kojima's more like. Lale Lule Lo. Lale Lule Lo. Lale Lule Lo. He's all quiet, <laughs> mysterious, and tries to be cool really, really hard. To be fair, he succeeds more than he fails. See, Tomar? I was just being dumb last time. See, I was an idiot on purpose. Take that, engine. That was stupid on Piopius. I'm gonna fucking snit! Bless you. Oh, that hurt. Do you know every time you sneeze, you die? <laughs> for 0.5 seconds? Really? Is I it, don't know. That was like a popular. Like, wasn't that supposedly like the at least the myth behind why people say "God bless you"? They believe that your soul leaves your body when you sneeze, and if, so, if someone has to say "God bless you" for it to come back, or 
I think that like might have that. been a Simpsons joke. I'm not sure if that's real. I, Although a lot of Simpsons jokes then kind of go on to become like playground legend. So <laughs> I, I don't know. It's true. Yeah, I didn't have to do that shit well, that's once. The, that's the story I heard. I just couldn't tell you where I heard it. Maybe it was the Simpsons. I wonder, do you get power-ups in this game, or is it just a mask? Probably not. I mean, we know that eventually there's other playable characters, so who knows? Engine, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck you, die! <laughs> Okay. And Jin suffers a concussion, has a brain hemorrhage, and nobody calls the hospital. <laughs> so Akano is... was Stupid. the guy that was in the drum? Is that the same guy as the dude at the beginning of the game, or is that a different mask? No, that's mask? Uka. Oh, okay. Sorry, Toma. You're saying they all look the same to you? Mm -hmm. All masks look the same, huh? <laughs> You know, they all look pretty similar. <laughs> for someone that wears as many social masks as you, Tomar, you'd think you would be able to recognize one. Jeez. <laughs> that makes me sick. I'm getting roasted here. <laughs> oh, we're at the pirate place. We're gonna keep on rolling. Booty calls. This is where Tana comes in. She slathers her big fucking asshole down and crashes primordial cock. <laughs> that was oddly specific. <laughs> <laughs> I like it to be a bandicoot. <laughs> Are we going to talk like this the entire, the entire let's play? Yes, I am cosplaying a slow old bandicoot. Back in my day, I went through a phase of cronking. Cronking? Did you say cronking? <laughs> oh, I haven't heard of cronking. Oh, yes. I cannot, I cannot scale this gap. What is cronking? My hamstrings are not ready for this. You don't, you don't remember <laughs> cronking? It was like the rap equivalent of like the insane clown posse stuff. Really? I think so. That people would just like dress up as clowns and like kind of flail their arms and shit. Well, wait, was it just a <laughs> was it just a juggalo thing? I don't know if it was a juggalo thing or if it was like an offshoot of the juggalo thing. Oh. I don't know. It it lasted all of like three months and then it was gone. It was one of those. I was gonna those. say all my friends at some point were into like ICP. I. Really? Yeah, I, I never. What? I actually never did. And Wait, I'm not, I'm not like, just like mutual friends that you and I both share, or like this is this is me in like uh like early middle school. Oh, the old you. Yeah. Okay. So so it's it's not people that we know had. had no, it's a, not people that you know. A juggalo uh, phase. These are people who I've since you know seen, and and I don't think they're still juggalos. That they all have. You they're know, not, what? Fuck they're not you. down with the clown anymore. No, I'm pretty sure the the ICP appealed. A lot to like high schoolers and middle schoolers in the in the late mid to late nineties or whenever their heyday was. Yeah. I see miracles every day. <laughs> My little boy looks just like me. Remember that part? It's yeah. the best part. There's a I'm not even that that is shit. one of those weird things where like there's certain things that don't age gracefully into being old guys, and I think ICP is going to be one of those things. <laughs> you know what I mean? They're going to be the coolest old guys. We talking about? I love seeing those guys from ACDC when they're like thrashing, and the guy's still wearing the shorts, and he's got like giant varicose veins popping <laughs> yeah. out. But, but but you know what? You want to suck on him? Props to him. I think the drummer went to jail for trying to have his wife killed. That's fair. That's that's happened a few times. That happened to the guy from uh, As I Lay Dying too. Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. What's what's oh. with what's with celebrities and wanting to murder their wives? It's funny. <laughs> I mean, it's it doesn't everybody. <laughs> Whoa. Celebrities are the ones that can do it. <laughs> it was uh, 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 William Shatner. Oh yeah, all those people thought William Shatner potentially like oh, had yeah. his wife murdered. And that is still one of those, like, nebulous things that there's no, like... Nobody seems completely certain that he's innocent. Just that it, he was never, you know, convicted. OJ had his wife, uh, kissed. <laughs> Cared for for long after. Um, yeah, he sure did. Why Allegedly. did OJ make such a silly lie? Why did, why did he tell such a goofy lie? <laughs> why did he write a book about it? <laughs> what was his deal? <laughs> Oh, that was my favorite thing ever. Do you remember Jiggle Billy from Aquatine Hunger Force? I call me Anderson the Jiggle. <laughs> yeah, I'm Jiggle Billy. That was the funniest thing in the entire world. <laughs> I thought it was pretty funny. Some our Aquatine season two and three is like the funniest shit ever. 
What the hell is they, this? That show really was ahead of its time when it started off. I, I, I do think it was great. I, I couldn't even tell you when it got bad, because at some point I think Whoa. I just stopped watching it just because... I don't know, because there wasn't much else good on Adult Swim, so I just didn't watch Adult Swim anymore. Yeah. But I had always liked Aqua Teen when I was watching it. Yeah, I thought it was the funniest shit at the time. Although, like, I don't know, there was a certain point in my life where I thought, like, cartoons that swear and stuff was just the funniest thing, and I guess I never really grew out of it, but... Oopsie. There was There was a time especially where I feel like my <laughs> filter... That was utter that seemed, shit. That seemed cheap. Yeah. I could have sworn you, you would have gotten him before he got Crash's you. Crash's hitbox is too small. I'm not joking when I say that. Like his hitbox or when his he spins. Or his, or yeah, I guess it would be his hitbox. Yeah, when he spins, his hitbox should be bigger. Yeah, instead he has a... He doesn't have a hitbox, he has a spin sphere. Apparently. Yeah, coin that term, everyone who's writing an angry think piece right now. <laughs> the spin sphere. The spin sphere. Yeah. This level looks gorgeous, though, I will say that. Or the, the, pendu the pendulous... Pill. I don't. I was trying to think of a P word relating to rotating that. I also don't that, think that, that animation also, that reads sounded very like well. pill. The pendulous pill. Well, because pills are becoming a more and more common hitbox shape. Yeah, and they fucking not. suck in nearly every regard. <laughs> Chris doesn't like the pill-shaped hitboxes because they have like, the idea is that because the pill has like curves on the top and bottom, because it's literally shaped like a. It's yeah, ovular. Sort of like a vertical pill. Yeah. yeah. And the idea is that because it's got the like the sort of like e like eased side on the bottom, it helps like dealing with like corners and like sliding down hills and things like that. But I think I think it, reality is usually less than ideal with regard to that. I love making a big mess. Mess I Bandicoot. Love going boom boom. Well, okay. Okay. All right. I think, the, okay, I think you were supposed you to approach it from that side, and you were oh. never supposed to go that way. <laughs> All right, that would make more sense. I was actually confused as to you how you would have been ways. able to gauge that. Multiple paths. Crash isn't linear anymore. Would you play an open world Crash Bandicoot game and suck your thumb? That was like Twin Sanity. Was it open world? Kind of. It was kind of like Jack and Daxter. That kind of. A there open was world. a period where like everyone felt obligated to do open world because that was the hotness. The was hotness. A, I I've always liked open world games, so I didn't really mind that phase. I like both linear and open world. But I just, I like open world games when there's actually shit to do. I think the problem with <laughs> open world games is usually people don't design many mechanics to have fun in them. So you're just walking around doing nothing. Yeah, I, I think a lot of people build them because they, they feel like they have to. Yeah. Or like they feel like, oh, if we make a game that's really, really long... Then that People makes it. People think it's more yeah. worth their sixty bucks. Yeah. If you're gonna have an open world, have fun movement mechanics. Fucking, uh, you know that GTA server we have? Yeah. I go on that every single day just to enable this one kind of mod that <laughs> the, the coder put on. So you you get a booster on your car and you can hold down Control. Oh, so there's there's three different kinds of boosts. There's a forward boost, a diagonal up boost, and an up boost. And you can just fucking shoot your car around, and it's the funnest shit in the world. You can blast down highways at super high speeds and just fly. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure we've used that in stuff we've recorded, right? Yeah, but... You can get really good at, like, like drifting with it and shit, and it's just so fucking fun. So you're a pro now, is what you're I'm, saying. I'm pretty damn good, I it won't is, lie. It's true, if you could find a game that, like, made that a mechanic and and, and gave you some more, like, in-game li like... That's essentially know, Distance. You ever played Distance? No, I've never that game Distance. Is, oh, dude, if you like racing games, it's really good. I was gonna say, I haven't truly enjoyed a racing game since, like, Burnout 3 or something. Dude, I, Burnout 3 was so fucking good. Oh my god, why did I do that? Fucking, uh, Distance gives you so much movement options, it's crazy. I've never been a big racing game guy. I'm not really either, but I, I love movement, and I love forward momentum. Yeah, what about that that cool uh, the ball game we played? I, I kind of am curious to see oh, yeah, that, that the full so version of that cool. XO1 or XO Core, whatever yeah, it, was it was called. Was, it was called like XO it something. Was called ball. It was called Ball of you Duty. You call it Ball. Ah, uh, 69. Let's get it. You, oh, you just <laughs> left like three crates there. <laughs> yeah, and he's leaving a pile of gold there. He's stupid. It's valueless to me. Whoa. <laughs> If I was evolved only a few million more years, 
I would realize I could turn around. I don't know why I turned into Carl Weezer there. <laughs> you know what I think about a lot? What do you think about a lot? There's like little mammals and marsupials clinging to trees with their fucking long ass thumbs, and they don't know anything about politics or banks. Yeah. And they're so much better. Are you saying off. you wish you were one of them? It's just funny, like, like. If you were a little thing clinging to a tree with your long ass thumbs, like, what's the last thing you'd expect to evolve into? Probably a dude in a suit that's obsessed with stocks. I don't know, it's fucking weird. <laughs> yeah, but you'd just be thinking about a hawk getting you, which is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> well, what look the fuck? who showed up. <laughs> like, I, I can appreciate babe. stuff like that where they play around with the map for, like, narrative purposes. You don't really expect stuff like that to happen on a world map. You were accosted by it, but a single rat. <laughs> That's beautiful. <laughs> yeah, that is actually pretty cool looking. That's if wonderful. only Captain Marvel could <laughs> save us from this predicament. That's Captain Marvel. She's in the bathroom too. Maybe that's just a filter they put on everything. Maybe. Okay, she's got they a roundhouse kick. They just want everyone kit. to sound like they're in a bathroom. Maybe. Maybe they they got one recording back that sounded like the person was in a bathroom and, and they were like, well, well, it's a lot easier to make everyone else's sound shitty than yeah. to make this one sound good, so... Is that supposed to be his, uh... His sweetheart? His boyfriend free girl? Tomar, you have to admit, she's fucking disgustingly overweight, dude. <laughs> she's not. She's fucking repulsive, Tomar. She looks pretty... Tomar! She's got weird thumbs! She's fucking disgusting, Tomar! Look at her thumbs, you'd never have sex with that! <laughs> Why? Her fucking goiter is shaking, Tomar! Her goiter is floitering! <laughs> I kicked him! Was that like a Jerry Lewis word? What did you just say? <laughs> her goiter? Her goiter is for loy. It sounded like he said her goiter is Freud Laven, basically. Freud Laven. Freud Laven. Is her hitbox the same as Crash's? Because she's got like a forward kick. You'd oh. think that would have a completely different hitbox. Yeah. I guess it is. It's like a forward projection. Oh, yeah, I can do the hook. Such a weird thing. <laughs> she's got a slappling hook. It makes her more like Just Cause. Hey, you can't use him. You're a lone wolf, right? Fucking she never hypocrite. said that. She, she will. Yeah. If she says she's a lone wolf, if, yeah. If she, okay, if she says I'm a lone wolf at any point in the game, we'll give you that. Okay. Oh. Try jumping on him. Just try jumping on him. Well, okay, so that's how you're supposed to deal with that. Yeah. He does you, have eight eight arms with swords. It would make sense that you'd want to attack from above. And, and I, I will give you that it doesn't quite read because his swords were, in fact, pointing up. But I guess that's just how that enemy is beaten. Yeah. I'm not gonna linger on it. I'm not gonna ruin my good time with my friends. Are you enjoying this more than the demo? Yeah. It is It is kind of weird. I feel like they give you, like, not good oh. levels. For, yeah, it was almost one. like what someone the on the team was like, wait, I don't want to spoil our good levels, just give them the shit ones. Oh yeah, that'll make a good first impression. I just don't know why you would choose ice levels for your demo. Nobody likes ice levels. Agreed. Yeah, whoever made that call, uh... That, that's actually kind of a bad call. <laughs> it was me. Uh, you, you sabotaged yourself and everyone else? I did consulting on this game for one minute before they said, get out? We don't know you? <laughs> Look, did you see how many times I kicked the box there and it didn't break? Yeah, interesting characters have flaws, Chris. Get used to it. Stupid rats. Stupid rats, stupid rats. So, this game is about time travel. And I, ha I have a consistent thought about time travel that I know is wrong. But do you guys feel this way too? I feel like if I got sent back in time, and I don't know why I think this, I feel like I could just beat up everybody there. No, you would die so fast. But, like, I know that but back in my in time, heart of hearts. People didn't like know what a gym was or how to even get stronger other than like, oh, people who fight a lot seem to be really good at fighting. Yeah, exactly. Like for some reason I feel like if I went back to like the Renaissance, nobody would know how to like throw a punch or like clench a fist. 
I know that's wrong. But, I, I don't but, know but why I feel that way. But wouldn't they all be carrying around big swords that made those unim those things unimportant? Yeah, but for some reason, I feel like if I really wanted to, I could just punch my way to the king of France and then, like, kick his ass, too. You I don't saying. know why I think that, but for some reason, I think if I went back in time, I would just be disproportionately stronger. An, it was an arrow like, where a man's freedom was... Oh. <laughs> I think you needed to grab I that thought, instead of... I thought it was going to pull me over. F*** that. Lyle, you could just cough on them and they die. Oh, there. You can pull over to there. I, I mean, I guess it. that's also true. We would have, like, modern diseases, but I don't... I don't know, for some reason I feel like I'd be like a foot and a half taller than everybody and like the max anyone back then could lift is like 40 pounds. I thought they proved that like men back then were actually like, like knights then were gargantuan but they thought they were short because all the intact suits of armor they were finding were short and that turned out to be because they all belonged to like inbred noblemen. Hmm. <laughs> that could be true. <laughs> like me. <laughs> Are you an inbred nobleman? Pretty much. Cool. I made it. You've done it. Oh, Tana, you're so fing epic. You dude. saved him. It's good to see you guys. It's been a long time for me. Oh, we lost touch in your universe too, huh? Yeah, you could say that. <laughs> what did we like die or something? What? No! Nope. No, but no, definitely not. So how are things in your dimension? <clears throat> the usual. So, wait a minute, Lyle, you need to hear this shit. Huh, so, uh, what you collecting? Crystals? Mm -hmm. Gems? Masks? Ooh, fun! Also, gems? Wait, this is it. Sorry, I fly solo. Fuck you guys. Oh, she's- she did say it! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, she didn't you li literally Come on, use... Miss Solo, you can't use Aku Aku anymore. Yeah, he's not allowed to be your friend. Aww. Chris, you were right all along. I saw it in a trailer. Oh, well, you cheated. <laughs> no, no, I didn't fucking have to say I saw it in the trailer. I was trying to say that the whole time. Also, what were you guys saying? I'm sorry. I don't know. I was just saying, I just like, wanted to, I told you so. That's you're, it. You were right, but I think if we can admit that you were right, we can also admit that I would be right that, like, if you went to the past and everybody had ruffles on their sleeves and stuff, you could, like, kill them in one punch. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Don't you want to go back and do more Tana timelines? No thanks. And learn the, the no dark thanks. history of how no Crash in her no universe thanks. actually no thanks. did die? No thanks. Okay. <laughs> that, this looks awesome. You think if if Crash died in her universe and she cared about him, when she saw him again, she'd want to like suck exactly. on his nose and stuff. Exactly. They made her into a horrible bitch just there. <laughs> Not like bonk him on the head like a cartoon animal. Maybe try to fucking think about this shit when you write your fucking children's video games. Do you think Crash licks people on the face? Yeah. He kind of does act like a pet dog. That's a horrible thought. I love it. That ceases to be cute if they can stand on two feet. He's cute. You wouldn't want Goofy to lick your face? Ah, uh, no. Gross, dude. <laughs> Come here, Max. Yeah, I just want to lick run. your face like I used to. I actually do think Crash from Crash 2 on the PS1, he was cute. He didn't look as, like... We're dogs, it's what we do! I'm trying to think, actually, what is the... This guy's more pointy and fucking smug, and he's smiling, and he's like, nah, he's pointy. On the PS1, he's like this cute little guy, he's like, oh. I think the PS1 just left more to your imagination, no, Chris. And no, you, and I remade let's... that model we... in full fucking HD. I do have to say, you have quite the imagination. No, I remade him in HD with full polygons, and he still look cute. Yeah. So fuck He did. Thank you. I love you, Crash. The one who won, <laughs> who made a plea for beefaroni. Yeah, yeah. The very no. same. That's uh, that was a PS1 model we downloaded. Oh, that was an actual PS1 model. Yeah, no, I may. I'll show it to you. <laughs> also, yeah, I use shave keys. <laughs> the original beefaroni I plea. I, st I still go back and watch that like once a year. <laughs> I still think it's hilarious. <laughs> I can't believe people got mad over it, but uh, you know, I put shape keys on that PS1's face to make him look sad. He didn't look cute at all, he looked fucking devastated. <laughs> There's also a problem with his belly button. There always has been, and the media will fail to address it time and time again. <laughs> Nobody will talk about Crash's belly button. Okay, this time, I'm not gonna die here like a goddamn imbecile. Just gonna skip the boxes. <laughs> Just rush right through it. <laughs> yeah. Look, this looks really nice. 
Oh, it's oh, one of these levels. Run the board. I love these parts. That's sick. And it feels the same. There's probably gonna be a lot of nitro. Wow. Oh, fuck, that scared the shit out of me, this fucking thing. Don't be scared of it. Okay. All right. This looks gorgeous. Do a sick jump off that ramp. Hell yeah. Ooh. Woo! Well, that's all the fun you get for today. I was today. gonna say, that was a really slow move. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, this green reminds me of my green room. I wish we oh. had an Oni Plays green room. With refreshments. And a dog. My green room is notorious among celebrities. <laughs> yeah, at this point, the Oni Plays green room would uh -oh. have at least three dogs. <laughs> I would record so much compromise from my green bonus room. Level. Oh! Whoa. Okay. Bonuses are for honuses. You almost said the other word. W what was the other word? <laughs> honuses. <laughs> <laughs> I just mean like Honus Wagner, who is the only Honus I've ever known of. Wagner, the musician? No, he was like a baseball player, and that's literally all oh, I know about him. He was I think it's pronounced Wagner. Oh yeah, you're right. Honus Wagner? No, I think he went by Wagner. He was an <laughs> American baseball player. This is bad. More like an American bitch ball player. Bitch! Yeah, I said it. I love calling American sports legends bitches. <laughs> I do too. I, I feel like if I went to a sports diamond, and I don't know why I feel like I could do this, but I feel like I could beat up everybody there. Fuck. <laughs> Stop saying that. <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> I feel like if I met Mike Tyson, I could just beat him up. I don't know why. Yeah, Honus Wagner was like Whoa. an eight, like a late 1800s to early 1900s baseball player. Okay, like that's a perfect example, right? I don't feel like I could beat up Mike Tyson now, but for some reason, I feel like if I went back in time and fought even like though the he boxing would be in champion better... of like London and like in like 1750. Yeah, dude, he, he would be black and white, and I could fucking kick his ass. Yeah, he wouldn't even know like all the colors that we have now. <laughs> yeah. I could show him blue and he'd be perplexed and then, you know... There's probably some truth to that. They probably had like one variant of the color blue back then. You just go back into the 60s and show someone the iPhone and while their mind is being blown you slug him in the face. Whoa. You could win. <laughs> yeah, you could do the April O'Neil trick from Turtles 3 where you you tell them you're Ooh. a witch and the person in your Walkman is, is some musician you trapped. You could do it. April O'Neil did that shit? Yeah, in, in, in the... In the in, uh, Turtles in Time. What a or, fucking bitch. Is that what it was? No. Turtles in Time was a game. What was the name of the third Turtles, Ninja Turtles movie? Turtles in Ancient Japan. Was that one of those weird, like, straight to VHS ones? Kind of, yeah. Yeah. Basically, I, I think it did maybe hit theaters, but it, it was, like, definitely the half assed sequel. Like, the costumes didn't look nearly as good as no. in the first two movies. Is it the one with, like, the weird girl turtle? No, no that, that was like a weird girl turtle. That was that's... that was like an actual television show mm. called like Back to the Sewers or something like that. I love the aesthetic of this level. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I thought cool. for a second that you're gonna go end up dying from those crates appearing no. on you. No, the wooden ones are fine. Oh, okay. They can't. Only the metal ones can crush you out of existence. Yeah. Oh, he got a fish bone. He can't do that. I like all these zany characters you're running into. One of them's called Zany. He better be. Oh! Yeah! Take that, Captain. I'm a little bandicoot, nothing can stop me. Yeah, how come each of these sharks appears to be a captain? Really? It's like they did no fucking research on sharks or something. See, uh, they've all got the captain hat. This level's fucking long, holy shit. No, Chris, you're long. Penis. Oh, you made them explode. <laughs> oh, look at me go, dude. It's like Ooh. I'm an expert or something. Oh, yeah. It's like you <laughs> meticulously <laughs> studied the ways of the bandicoot. I did. I love, I like, they, they can kill themselves. Please don't hurt me. Look at you weaving. That water looks so cool. Why don't you just Oh, no, they missed it. it. Yes! Oh no! Fuck! I didn't even see him! I was doing oh, so good. Oh, there was good. a checkpoint right in sight, too. No need to be mean, though. That's not mean, it's just true. No need to make me it's feel like a dunce. It's just the sad truth of your reality. <laughs> your reality? Oh no, this is the fuck. This is the fuck! No! Ah! Oh! Okay. oh my god! Oh! <laughs> that was awesome. 
Oh no. This if looks... that had hit you, you would not have said that was awesome. You oh. would have said, this guy's bullshit. That guy looks fucking rad. And That's... he's got a normal person's name. It's Louise. I think it's a lady. Oops. It looks like, uh, the uh, lobster from, uh, Moana. Oh yeah, it does kind of have a I face like that. I was a sad little crab once. Oh fuck! Oh, you just gotta make him hit shit? Yeah, do you have to steer those into him? Oh right. yeah, because those guys explode, I guess? Yeah. There yeah. you go. Not so bad. Uh, yeah! Yeah, fuck you! Yeah, fuck you! It almost feels like the more, the more tentacles he has out, the easier he is to hit. Yeah. Oh no, but now this is getting kind of scary. Oh, you got it. Yeah, you got him. Ah, <laughs> fuck you, Louis. I mean, she, Louise. Ah, you it's slapped it's, my arms <laughs> until I died. It's ah, Louise. You slapped me. I did it, I did it, I did it. Do you think, like, you could die from someone, like, slapping your arms too many times? If it was, like, 50,000 times, maybe. Your arm would get, get so red, and all the blood would rush into your one arm that it would actually vacate <laughs> your brain and your heart. Oh, look, a new thing, a new story. <laughs> well, right. I want to hear this Two fucking new stand. mask! Two to go. Feeling a little less panicked. I, I was at a 10 before, now I'm at a solid, let's say, 9.78882. Oh yeah, these bandicoots are here to help. Bandicoot. Follow. Short Fuck. and to the point. Love this guy. He is pretty cool. He's friends with you now. He was really scary when he was scowling, with no arms. I don't like it when I'm scowled at. Scowl, scowl, scowl. I hate it when Tomer scowls at me. Mm. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, this place looks pretty. Oh, is that, was Louise the boss of that level? I guess so. Oh uh, yeah, look at that. That's weird. That didn't feel quite as like. It didn't feel like a boss as at big all. as Engine did. Give Dude. it a spin. That's what I always say when I'm in feudal Japan. <laughs> Give it a spin. Feudal. Yeah. Infertile. Like it'd be futile to try to fight me because I'm eight times as strong as anyone back then. But they literally all carried swords. Well, I guess that was just samurai. That is. But the those most were all over the place. The nicest thing you've ever said. <laughs> I don't know. A man's. A man's freedom was gauged by the, si the 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 length of his sword. Is it not now, Tomar? Is it not now? How now, brown cow? <laughs> oh, that could have been bad. That could have cut his head off. <laughs> no one just keeps a gong outside. It would get rusty. Those things are expensive. Whoa, dude! You can't say that! You can't say chuckle nuts! I mean, if he could say it, I could say it. Oh shit, it's a bona fide pinhead. Fun little game for you to play. I've got a reward for the clever bandicoots who can reach my testing grounds. <laughs> Is his name Enbryo? Yeah. yeah. The diabolical creations along the way. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Is he the boss? Whoa. This guy does something crazy. What He's gonna do? get a new power. You Whoa. can do the dark matter spin. Is it forever? I guess so. That's fucking awesome. Oh, and it smashes crates, like or the metal crates. Oh. oh, oh shit! That's fucking cool. That's a really good idea. I love that. You're just like a big floating top. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Well, that doesn't. Well, you that got, looks I, really shallow. I think you got to use that. Yeah, I did not realize that was a hazard. That was a, not well telegraphed. <laughs> Look at me go, look at me go. You're doing it, you're really doing it. Thanks, Lyle! What the hell is that? Whoa, oh no. It's... You always have to be moving a direction with that. Wait, does the music change when you're doing that? It seems yeah. like it, yeah, it, it makes it do like a, like a, like an oscillating thing. <laughs> That's so fucking cool. Oh. No, stop. Okay. Ooh. That's the little embryo. I really, 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 really. Is embryo the actual, like, he's like the real, like, the creator of homunculi in this world? I don't know. He seems like a Zack character. <laughs> he's that He's that Russian dude that made an egg monster the and smashed it, smashed it with a Russian Bible. But <laughs> yet. I kind of hate how the masks are worn on your back as a full bodysuit. It looks really stupid. I wish he just wore him on his face. Yeah, it's kind of weird. It seems like it'd be like... 
That seems like an idea that would emerge in like a concept art book. It's like they couldn't stand to think like Crash wouldn't be able to show his lovable face for a section of the level. So you'd rather him like wear it over his head? Yeah, that is kind of what masks are for. They look cool anyway. You can have the masks be expressive, and then they're a little character. I, I guess the the logic behind it would be that it's on his back, so it reads that he has it. But I don't yeah, I don't think that that really would matter if he wore it like on the top of his head, like a helmet or something. Yeah, maybe that would be a better solution to that. He just he wears it on his face. In the first three games, he wears fucking Aku Aku in his face. When you go invincible. Wow. Yeah, I guess it's not it's not like he keeps those things for any extended period of time. So whoa. Oh, uh, this Joker again. You've never met him before. Come on, man. You don't gotta say shit like that. What are those called? Like, shishis? The little, like, dog lion things? You're stupid. <laughs> Whoa. Oops. There you go. Oh, maybe the only reason they put him on the back is because maybe you can still become invincible. Oh, maybe. Oops. Look at me go, look at me go, look at me go! That stopped me there for no reason. Got me. Okay. If uh, if you met Crash Bandicoot in real life and he said, "I'll hang out with you for a day," but you got to do that thing that Instagram influencers do, where I hold your hand and then you like dangle off of a building and we take a picture of it, would you do uh. it? <laughs> if Crash was holding me, yeah. Or I'm holding him. I you've hate seen the that, people you've do seen that, that thing where where it's like. It's like, do you trust your partner this much? And it's like, it's like some Whoa. girl in yoga pants, like holding her partner's hand and like leaning off a cliff or a building I, or something. I can't stand people like that. Yeah. Why not? Like, I really hope every one of them falls. <laughs> I, I, like, I'm not even just saying that to be a dick. Like, if, if you're going to do that to like prove some point to the world about like you having like a better relationship than them like just fuck you yeah just fall and yeah, the fact, just fall. Like the that. fact that i haven't heard a story of any of them falling really proves that it's not that big of a deal anyway yeah right like if one in eight of them fell or even even like one in ten then it would be more like okay you're really fuck, putting trust in this guy because it. there's <laughs> There's there's a track record of people dying this way, Oopsie. right? Like, yeah. really, really, no one's fallen from from that that oh, I yeah. know of. So I have. Basically, my point is, Chris, don't you trust Crash? Fuck, dude, keep overshooting it. You know that yellow circle would really be handy right now. You can turn it back on if you want to, you know, admit you're a hypocrite. No, nah, I'm not a hypocrite. I think a shadow would be just as good. Actually, yeah, you don't see a shadow over it, do you? Nope. I mean, you could tell me, Chris. Like, is his shadow there? Is that is that reacting dynamically to anything? Or That's do you an think actual that it... like directional sunlight. Yeah. All I'm saying yeah. is, come November, if they add like another version with no yellow ring, then we know for a fact that somebody's listening. I'll to kiss you. whoever did it right on the right on the. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. I wish I didn't have to resort. I wish Sorry, I didn't bros. have to resort to that yellow circle. <laughs> I hate looking at it. Whoa. Why is everything being mean to me? Yeah, he called you a marsupial, which I'm pretty sure is like your word. I sure I'm glad yeah, I got that checkpoint. That's 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 their word. That's their word, man. Oh fuck. I think you gotta get a run and start. Yeah. Also, this guy said a boogadabot too. But he they said They all say it. Well no, I'm what I'm saying. They're is all he... like versions of whatever Aku Aku is. Holy he fuck. said a boogadaba, which means that that means something in that language. Oh my god. Clearly. There's a guy like like that wrote the Star Trek Klingon language or the Game of Thrones language that wrote the language for the Crash Bandicoot masks. It's probably just like some cultural catchphrase, like witness me. There's a there's in a Mad whole Max lexicon. Fury Road. Yeah. Oh, so you, you didn't, didn't even, even have, have to. Yeah, fuck him. I oh. fucked up. I oh, fucked no. up. Wait, you couldn't have double jumped from there? Oh, no, that was the end of the mm. level. A boogie de ba. How dare you say that? Yeah, he says it with really good diction, too. How dare you stand where he stood? Oh. I'm telling you, they, they have like a like a consultant there that tells them exactly how to pronounce things in that language. Oh, thank God for that. Oh, thank Jesus. That's I, B, that's when B. you leave those easy hanging crates, it still does get to me. I do it just because of that. 
I do with the fucking. What's that version of Crash? He's got a muzzle on. Is he supposed to be like Crash as Ty the Tasmanian Tiger? No, he had a muzzle on because he's a rabid dog. Oh. He'll get you, Tomar. I thought those were Don't like tiger stripes eye. on his face. <laughs> I did not interpret that correctly. I don't interpret your sarcasm correctly. What? Oh, <laughs> uh, let's go into Tana for just one, one, one period. One, whoa. <laughs> one period. That's gonna be like a month, dude. <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> That's gonna be. <laughs> I think it only lasts a week, Lyle. I think this is gonna be some sort of some sort of potion commotion. I think there's gonna be some kind of lotion commotion if she keeps looking that good. <laughs> I hope she shows some motion with the lotion. I hope she shows some emotion with the lotion. I hope she puts the lotion on her areolas. <laughs> What's better, hairy tits or normal tits? Hairy tits or scary tits? Now what do you think? Why is she looking that way? That's what you call hairy tits, neo Why did she start the level like not looking at the front of the level? Uh, I don't know why that bothered me so much, but it did. I don't know, I think that's kind of cool. Like that, like right? Yeah, she was looking to the right. Maybe there's- but, dude, a secret. Crash is weighing his options with every bitch in the room. I thought this game was called Crash Bandicoot. Not stupid fat bitch bandicoot. <laughs> oh, do you want the lights off, by the way? Uh, you call me ugly? No, you just usually have the lights off. Because I'm ugly. No, <laughs> I don't even have to look at you. Who I to care? This is a new era of Chris. He got his node surgery. He's beautiful now. My nodes? Your nodes? My lymph nodes? Your, oh, yeah, lymph nodes. He got, got his lymph nodes removed, so now he can't be affected by disease. I'm pretty sure that's how that works. <laughs> Please, that... that that's not true. Nobody take that as medical advice. Nobody remove your lymph nodes. <laughs> oh, dude, she's talking about nipping. Really? Finally. I think this is the best thing they've ever added to a video game. A, uh, directional grappling hook? Yep. Well, use it. No. Nope. Use it on that guy. Uh -oh. Wait, did that just get a... What? The lily pad. It had concrete cracks in it. I or think it had... The... It had a face. Oh. Yeah, it did. What? <laughs> yeah. Press R2. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. Nice. Okay, Tomar. What do you think of that? Oh, Hawaii. I. Uh, uh, what? <laughs> Way to go. She deserved it. Did that did that genuinely freeze you up when she said kawaii? All I wanted did her to really do Did she really say kawaii? Yeah, she, she did. Went, oh, kawaii. That's- I refuse to believe that's what she said. Are you st there, It was written said. right- It was right- written and said. So she says that about- About uh, that, yeah. About the thing that's gonna kill her. Aqua, no, about Aqua, this I mean. huge ass dragon, I'm guessing. I don't understand why she said it. It doesn't even make sense. Uh, at least she could double jump. Oh fuck, I forgot about that. And she does a sweet flip. Oh god. Dude, this level's getting crazy hard. If oh, there's god. anybody in our audience that can do a flip, have you ever used it ever. outside of, <laughs> like, to show off? Has there ever been an instance in your life where you've gone, this would be one for a flip? Because I've been trying to come up with one, and I absolutely cannot. I'm sure you're going to get a cool few stories tweeted at you. There, there, there absolutely has to be at least one. I just can't think of it. Do a flip! What the fuck was that? Always look into the future, or forward. Ooh, you can look around. I didn't even know that. Can you believe that? You can look at that thing. <laughs> Great. That's exactly what I want my camera to be doing. Go, little lady, go. Wait, no. Fuck, I forgot. Yeah, you gotta- ooh. You gotta use your eyes. Yeah, they just- they just trained you a little. They're like, third step's gonna be the long <laughs> shot. <laughs> oh, I'm glad it's sucking her sustenance out. Okay, Tomar, rate her ass out of 10. No, I refuse. Why? Because that's like, uh... Oh, so you you're afraid gay. she's gonna okay. see it and get mad at you? <laughs> yeah, that's... yes. Please, Tomar, rate her ass, please! I... no! <laughs> please, Tomar! Why would I publicly do that? Because you're a man, are you not? Whoa. Don't be like that. Honestly, think she's trying just a little too hard to seem cool. Unlike me, who's naturally cool. 
Every time I see you, you're always crossing your arms and smirking. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what? <laughs> She's got this weird uncanny valley face. I think she's got kind of a weird uncanny she, valley body. She really body. does not look like the other bandicoots. No, yeah. She's not like the other girls is what I'm trying to say. So that's what happened in the, the other video level. Remember? Now we get to do the same level again. Oh. Great. You like that. I forgot that was a, a <laughs> thing you... that they did with these. Yeah, Why would you forget that? That is, that is weird that they make you replay it. It's almost like it's just filler content, huh? It, it kind of is, but it does, no, I, it serves a narrative purpose. It, like, links the two parts. It's unnecessary. It, maybe, but I think the idea is that they want fans to get all hype about the, you know, putting together the full narrative. I can't, you know, it's a still kind of got a story thing. It is what it is. You're just embarrassing yourself trying to look cool in front of Tana Bandicoot. I'm not trying to look cool in front of Tana Bandicoot. First you make you make all these rude just, comments about her ass, and then you try to fucking kiss up to her to make I'm up for it. All I'm thinking is like, there's some developer out there who did this. Like they they have, there's some intention there. Okay, guys, we didn't want to say anything, but we reported uh, Tomar to Oni plays HR after he made those comments about the ass. <laughs> so it, it, he he should be on better behavior now. We're really sorry about. But things. knowing him, he won't be. No, he's he's. <laughs> He's 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 allowed within. Is that the gag now that I'm that I'm that I'm trying that, that you're I'm, a scam that I refuse to raid a woman's ass and then <laughs> and that was yes. just because I got in trouble with HR. <laughs> I don't think we're a big well, enough company to require HR. There's there's no Oni plays HR. You uh, can't prove will that. Be. I feel stupid. Why does Crash make me feel stupid as an adult? Because he's operating on another level of intellect. <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of me. <laughs> oh, I'm never gonna get this, am I? You got it before. I know, but it was like an accident. So were you. Oh, shit, but you've the... made it work. Okay. Right. Uh, uh. Oh, I see. All you right, you that... definitely have momentum. Yeah, that controls a lot weirder than I maybe uh, thought. Okay. Yeah, you've got a. a... Oh, right. but you can hit the. You can't hit the TNT while spinning. Oh, uh, you're not supposed okay. to. God, that's weird. I know. All right, I see why you were fall. I was like, that, that doesn't look that hard. But now I see. All right, shit. See? Ooh. Okay. All right. The stupid suit removes your shadow. I'm at it. The shadow really doesn't seem to quite work right. Does no. It? no. Well. Oh god. It's like just projecting a shadow, like oh. a sing a solitary shadow. Am I on it? Yeah. Oh. On the wall. Okay. Oh, get that fucking I checkpoint. Think, you know what? I think it wants you to, like, do that and just get off of it. Mm -hmm. Probably. Uh, Watch well, out! Ah, it oh doesn't boy. matter. <sighs> oh, God. Be careful of the ones with teeth. I hate China. <laughs> this isn't China. This is another horrible land. Oh, fuck. Okay, cool. Oh, I don't care about that box, and I never have. That's the brain, isn't it? No, it's Pinky Dog. He doesn't say any of this. He says... It's, wait, what does he say again? He says a hi a herm... A hook. What does he say? Brink Prinky? Crinky? <laughs> what does Prinky say? <laughs> I'm Crinky! <laughs> Crinkles the rat. Crinkles the rat. He uses diaper fur. Oh no. Oh god. Pinky says something annoying. He says... <laughs> he says something. What is it? I think he just laughs weird. I don't know. It's been so long since I've seen that Fuck. shit. I need a look. God damn it. Google, what does Pinky say? Oh. What does Pinky say? Is what? his name really Pinky? Yes. Oh. I didn't Narf. Know. Fucking yeah, that's it. It's Narf. Oh, Narf. Oh, you meant Pinky for Pinky in the Brain. What else did, who else I is thought, called Pinky? I thought you were talking about the pink mask. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's purple. Sorry. I guess he is more purple. What is the meaning of Narf? The Rice University ne neo neo neologism neologism. What is that word? Neologism? I guess neologism. I what the fuck does that mean? The Rice University neologism. I think it's just like a newer oh, a newer phrase. Includes saying. not only narf as a random sound or nonce word. What the fuck? Nonce word. But also narfed as a verb to mean to be struck completely with some embarrassment or folly. 
Much as Pinky would be hit on the head by Brain after his follies ruined Brain's plan. What a shitty word. Yeah. If you have to say all that just to explain it, it's not worth it. Yeah. It's uh, better explained just by, like, it's the thing that uh, Pinky fuck. says. <laughs> It's just the thing that Pinky says. <laughs> that, yeah, nobody expected it, it to mean anything. It's just a yeah. random fucking word. Well, now you know the, the... Do you wish you could unlearn that information? Yes! Yeah. I kind of do. <laughs> I don't think that ever needed to be addressed by an ac in an academic setting, and yet it was. Some you disgusting Harvard fucking professor sat with his other <laughs> disgusting friends and came up with that. <laughs> That's a little harsh, but... They deserve it. You can't just sit around in a fucking circle and expect not to be made fun of for coming up with NARF. <laughs> I don't think they came up with NARF. It's... They came up with the meaning for it. Yeah, like, but we know what we need to but, discuss. But, but what they... the word the mouse says in that cartoon. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> they should come up with. Uh... I bet. You, w wouldn't it be awkward if that professor is a, is a listening? He's a fan of Oni Play. I hope he's listening so we can get fucking <laughs> banished from his job. <laughs> banished. <laughs> what would him listening get him banished? I don't know. He'll he'll get so embarrassed, his face will turn beet red, and the other professors will look over. Like, What's wrong? <laughs> What's wrong, dude? <laughs> Narf. I mean, nothing. Narfing. Narfing. <laughs> Narfing. <laughs> oh no! And that faux pas with his colleagues. He has a fupa. Ca causes a string. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna write a medium article called "My N Word Narf." <laughs> My N word. It got me cancelled. <laughs> I love the idea of a book called My N word about the word narf. Uh, work on it. This pig brain juice is really good. Chris likes that aloe juice. Pig brain. Dude, you're on Pandora, dude. Finally. Find Jake Sully. Who's that guy? I don't know, but he's about to get his dick kicked in. All right, doesn't I doesn't want you going back there. Yeah, they don't. They just don't let you kill that man. Hmm. That's fair. Murder is a sin. Here you go. So is swallowing bubble gum. Yeah, it stays. It uh -oh. grows a tree in your stomach if you swallow it. <laughs> oh, God. I want to see what that For does to kill you. I want to see like does it make his ears bleed or something. For some reason, I thought I still had the purple guy, but kill yourself. Stand there. Okay, <laughs> alright, I, I like, like that. that. <gasps> I don't think that you need more than one gong per building, honestly. Yeah, it's kind of overkill. There's kind of too many gongs? Too many gongs, bro. <laughs> what? I could have sworn I was like right on that. Alright. Depth will never be the same. Yeah, the depth perception in this game is really... Yeah, at times... That one would not have been helped by any manner oh. of fucking... God My turn, you die too much. Yeah. Wait, I want to try now. No, you can't try, you're Tomar. Tomar what? can try? You're the silly one of the group. That's not true. Not the masterful game player of the group. Oh, how do I use that power that I totally forgot to get? Oh, you wait. don't have it yet. Oh, I don't have it, okay. You can't really avoid it once you move past a certain point. See? Oh! See? <laughs> Whoa, you made so much fun of me! All right. My mom called the teacher! <laughs> And now look at you! Oh, oh wow. no, I did it! <laughs> you, you goose! Um, here. okay, I'll try. Chris, I'll, I'll go for it. it. Okay, we got it. Yes. Oh. Laughing at our oh. many attempts. I hate you, dragon. Who's laughing? This thing? No, I think that that's oh uh, that's that pinhead from earlier. Can you attack those things? <laughs> oh, that's right. I don't want to attack them. It was one of those videotapes. Yeah, you need a VHS player before you can interact with it. Alright, you're getting it. Oh, They're getting fuck. you to push this mechanic. I mean, that's fair enough. Yeah. It's not terrible, the momentum's a little bit weird, but... But it seems to make sense. Oh, I, th I think... If, if you were playing this, like, straight through, it probably... We probably should mention that we, like, stopped playing this game for a couple weeks before we came back to it. Well, maybe not a couple weeks, but, like, at least a week or two. You son of a bitch. Can you go in there? Is there a secret back there? No, nah, this is a place to put a dog. Uh, okay. I guess it's as good as any oh. a place to put a dog. Except for down. What the fuck was that? 
I made it and I found the golden wampa. Oh my god. Oh shit. Leave me alone. Kick him in the ass. Yeah, can't you can't you You can kill these things, right? You can I, just leave them alone. I could have sworn you killed one. Oh yeah, you spin him up the asshole. You're right. Okay. There you go. What's that thing? No box. Fuck no you. diamond. I did it, I did it, I did it. That's the loving tree or whatever the fuck from Avatar. The loving tree. Where they the put their hair in it? Yeah, they put their hair in it and the tree pees on them. <laughs> <laughs> they go, this is where you turn into the Avatar. And they put fucking... They, <laughs> they put, don't say the Avatar. Yeah, they put Legless Joe under the tree and then he turns into the Avatar. Oh, I keep thinking of Avatar The Last Airbender when you bring up Avatar and then having to recalibrate when I realize you're talking about the James Cameron film. It drives me fucking bananas that the very last shot of that blue movie, the the Avatar logo is green right at the very end of it. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> I don't understand why. <laughs> like it just suddenly turns green like, for like one frame? Is no, it is. Just, it's neon green. Oh, okay. Like it just goes, Avatar! Like like big logo at the very end. It's like, why the fuck is it green? That would drive me ballistic. Pandora though. is blue. All the creatures are blue. It's, you see a lot of blue in that movie. A blue man can't even write a, his own name in his own color. Shut Get up. Get fucked! <laughs> oh my god. I, that was the meanest thing Crash has ever done. You just hung up on him. Crash kinda dresses like a bully. Yeah, he does. Jump to wall run? Whoa. That is weird. Is that the coolest thing you've ever seen Crash do? I want him to do more than that. What's the coolest thing he could do? Well, it's kind of it's kind of cute how he scrambles on it. I like it. What are these supposed to be? They're ghosts. In China? They're guests. Yeah. Oh fuck. Evil Chinese ghosts, as is tradition. Whoa. Look at that fish. It's having a good time, and it flies. Say that, but better. What? Having a good time. It's having a good time? You gotta say, having a gay old time. Having a- like having the Flintstones? Like the Flintstones. Yeah. I'm surprised that they were that accepting back then. Uh... It went full circle. Everyone started off gay. And then they hated them for a while, and now... Now they like them again? Yeah. Okay. But the Flintstones were the first to like them. Right. <laughs> that all sounds historically accurate. That's why the Flintstones had that smoking episode. It was a metaphor. <laughs> I don't think that was an episode. I think that was an actual Winston cigarettes commercial. He said, now this is like Barney's pole. <laughs> narrow and smoky. This is a <laughs> in my hand. <laughs> oh, what the hell? I fucking... Damn it. <laughs> well, it's gonna be a long beep. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever guesses what I said can win a... Five day trip to Iceland. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Don't say that. We'll send them to a really rough part. <laughs> a really rough part of Iceland. Yeah. Make them regret ever guessing. Yeah. We should do that. And we should put a hidden camera in their backpack. Yeah, it should be like that scene in uh in Die Hard where Bruce Willis has the, the sign on him. The sign on him? Oh my god, I love that part. <laughs> I forgot about that. I, we just need to find out what that word is for the Icelandic people. A boogadaba. Is that really what they said the entire time? Even in Crash 1 and 2? A boogadaba? I think so. I oh feel like god. they said like ooga booga in the fucking first one. I always thought they said holmbuga. That doesn't mean nothing. I, I always thought it was ooga what you Whatever they just said. Stupid creature. Oh. Okay. I'm sure glad they made the ghosts punchable. I know. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Tomar said, my army. I'm not saying to dox Chris O'Neill, but you Tomar know what to do. The Tomar army? <laughs> the Tomar army? Okay, fucking Christ. Oh, yeah, I forgot I don't have that guy anymore. Yeah, it does just kind of take it away from you. And if your eyes are glazing over, you just kind of forget. To be fair, you, the big suit you wear of it is ridiculous. That's it's true. Hard to miss. But it's so ridiculous so often that you oh, forget fuck. who you are when you're wearing it. <laughs> you become him. Crash Bandicoot in the you're real so world. Right. Go, little guy, go. Do you think Crash ever loses himself in the power? In the power? In the power. 
<laughs> you mean like uh, the black Spider-Man suit? Yeah, exactly. Probably. Like he he can bend space and time, and he's kind of like a low-level being, you know. Like he doesn't he doesn't have much like cognizant thought. So you'd think, right? It would you'd think that this guy would probably be controlling him and not the other way around. <laughs> Fuck, I forgot I was on that. Oh, Ooh, oh my that was God. Real nice close. recovery. Oh. <laughs> that was scary. Who wants to play? I can give it a, a shot if you. Or Lyle's up you want. for it. Go, Lyle, go. I need a swig. I need to take a swig. <gasps> Be careful, Lyle. I am not afraid of these things. This is in the other realm. Test. This is. Everything's led up to this moment. I'm a gamer! <laughs> <laughs> Why are the uh, nitros suspended in air? I don't understand that. You almost killed yourself. Yeah, well, I didn't. Wow. Wow. That wow, didn't even need to be a uh, risk. Yes! Okay, videoed game. Wait, I can just leave them and yeah. just not fucking worry about it. Nice. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna... Whoa, holy fucking yeah, I don't think I don't think we're in this to, to get 100%. Without well, we're gonna get the bad ending. There's a bad ending? Uh, you think we're gonna get to the ending. <laughs> oh, cute, how cute. That's kind of mean, uh, Toma. <laughs> oh god! Why would you no! Do? Oh my god! They put the woe meme in. Did they? Yeah. But they conveniently didn't use my voice, I wonder why. Good job, you burnt his fucking nose. He deserved it. I mean, would it make crimes. sense for them to just have their crash do the voice? Oh, uh, that's kind of fucked up. Oh no! I thought he's, you were my friend, dude. But he's the crash. Ah! He, he's not the crash, he's a new guy. Yeah, but he's the crash for the new game. But I'm the meme! You're supposed to be my friend! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I think you're a lot bigger than just some meme, if that makes you feel any better, You don't mean Chris. that. I do mean that. You think I'm just a meme? This well, you, you even said it before. I've never oh, said God. that. Oh God! You're just a meme to me, don't you see? That's not true, Chris. You are not a friend or a person. <laughs> oh my God! It was right there. Bird, baby, bird. That's a little joke. What's that from? That sounded so familiar. Uh, Crackdown. Oh yeah. I played so much of that uh -huh. shitty game. It wasn't even good, but I played a fuck ton of it. It was kind of... It was unique at the time. I feel like it was just like the first, <gasps> like, ah. Uh, <laughs> I, I feel like it was just like the first, like, GTA-type game that had multiplayer. Did it have multiplayer? Yeah, that's that's the only reason I played so much of it. Mm. Was Wait, Crackdown? Yeah. I, I recently played, like, the last Crackdown that they made. It was, like, three, I think. Oh, was it any good? It was just sort of like something to like mindlessly pass like, you know, 10 hours of my life, but beyond that, I, yeah, I don't know. Oh uh, no. It's exactly what you're, uh, what you signed up for. Uh, I don't think it's bad. What? The Crackdown 3, it's just, I don't think it's anything particularly great. Do you think you'll remember it in a year? N no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh oh. Sorry, Crackdown 3. That's Mike Wazowski, bottom right. Put a little uh, barcode over him. <laughs> You're gonna fight Dr. Nitrius Brio. Oh, he, yes! He's gonna deserve whatever he's got coming to him. He Dr. Like Neo a, Brio. He looks like a complete jerk. Yeah, dingus. <laughs> Sorry about that. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Always with the pink and green. Oh, good! You've arrived! And now for your reward. He's gonna spit in your mouth. <laughs> Just stay put while I test this. Uh, all right. Wait. I don't have to listen to you. Okay. I guess I have to listen to him. Well, that was kind of <laughs> stupid. I, got, I, I, I figured it wouldn't work, but you might as well try it. Oh, he vaporized yeah, that you time. Got, you gotta leap over the little ring. Haven't you ever heard of ring jumping? Oh, oh. God. There you go. Oh, you hit it back at that's, him. That's 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 your. That's the version of the like exploding robot teddy bear from last time. What you just said right there was so epic, Tomar. Shut up, <laughs> Magello. Why would you do that? Exploding robot teddy bears XD. I thought that was what they used in the on the engine level. Were they teddy bears? I, I thought they were. Oh some, yeah, like, I know they were. were. Like, oh my god! <laughs> I wasn't trying to be a dick. <laughs> that was kind of cruel, honestly. This is a cool, like, lighting thing. I felt persecuted. It's just a fucking filter, dude. Have you been on Instagram? 
he's turning into oh no why did they do this again he why? turned into the amazing bulk agreeable grunt did, did he do this last time this isn't the first game what did you do did you kick him in the fucking head oh you all just right use your spinny spin yeah oh i gotta knock him well, off at least you I get assume. to do this I you guess. gotta sumo him yeah, 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 yeah. Him. yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, just avoid this till he's done raging. This doesn't seem very hard. Yeah, you're doing a good job. I don't know if this is what I'm supposed to be doing. Well, it's it working works. great, so keep doing it. <laughs> yeah, just Dick. sort of bouncing on his head. I, oh! oh my god, Lyle. Just gotta make sure I'm not doing that. Ooh. He's, yeah, the more hang time you can get, the easier it is to deal with all these a million rings. Oh god. I wonder is that grid thing on him intentional or not? Oh, uh, I don't know. Fucking dickhead. Oh! You did sit. What's it? Oh, no! 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 oh my oh, god. Oh, the game too. Oh. oh my god. <laughs> That's how he sounds now. He's a reptilian. Uh, his life is bad enough. You might call it, huh? What? Ew. What? Don't say that. <laughs> Wait, so, so he laid an egg and then cried and <laughs> ran away? <laughs> I'm a father now! He literally shut that out. I bet that's gonna come- that's a Chekhov's gun. That's gonna hatch into, like, a little thing that's gonna help them. Mm-hmm. And then Crash is gonna kill it with his fist. We gotta keep playing to He's find out. He's gonna smash it. What? No, don't let that live. <laughs> what do those do? I don't want to replay the old oh, ones. Oh, so that's them being like, wow, look, now you have more gems you have to go get. You have to play an inverted mode. version of the level. Oh, no. Wow. Don't do it. I absolutely don't want to do that. Yeah, nor should you. Look at that little green man. It's always got to be about the color of them, huh? Oh, I thought you were going to make a cool song. Oh, it was going to erupt into a big Broadway bit. What would you have Broadway sung about? I don't know. Maybe like uh, World Hunger or something. <laughs> World <laughs> Hunger? <laughs> I doubt that that would have been it. It's like Rent, but about being hungry. <laughs> I feel like we've talked about Rent before. All I know is the title of it. It's the worst thing ever made by a human. Yeah, I don't know. I, I'm not a big fan. Yeah, no, we've definitely talked it's about it. It's got like maybe one or two good songs that are like good earworms, uh, but... But the entire play is literally about, I don't want to pay. I don't want to pay rent. Yeah, it's about a bunch of like really entitled like bohemian artists who... I don't know, go around like spreading AIDS or something. <laughs> 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 That's it. Yeah, well, you should watch it if you want to like get a brain tumor. Isn't isn't that like what the what the musical at uh at the beginning of uh oh! Team America's yep. based on? Everyone has AIDS. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that is the the joke with Team America. It wasn't a joke though. It was kind of just factual that everybody has AIDS in Rent. Actually, that's not factual. Only one no, person. Yeah, it's has literally AIDS. just one character. It's but Angel. How much AIDS do they have, though? A fucking lot. See? They're they... the most aids ridden character I've ever fucking experienced. <laughs> this character sings a whole song about how she made a dog kill itself and how she thinks it's funny, and all the characters are like, Ah! She's so fucking cool and beautiful and magical! And her whole song is about how she killed a dog. I'm not even kidding. What a bitch. She's like, there's this dog, and it was barking, so I made it bark so much, it died. It's like, everyone's like, oh, Angel, you're so wacky. What the hell? Did Crash just get swiped by a clown? I don't understand what the fuck's happening. Where's the titties? Yeah, that's supposed to be... What the that's hell did crash. they do? Yeah. Wait, isn't there a character like that that's like Crash, but he's like... Yeah, it's fake Crash. Fake Crash? Mm-hmm. Is he in one of the mainline games? He's in... The game starting from three because Naughty Dog saw a bootleg Crash Bandicoot plushie that looked like fake Crash. They were like, that's funny. So they started putting him in their games. That's pretty good. It's kind of like the whole Den Hibiki thing. Wasn't it? He was a character. Or another game ripped off Ryu and Ken. 
with oh. a character called that looked like Dan Hibiki, so they just kind of stole him back. That's funny. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. I didn't know but, that that was the... Yeah. Is that why he sucks? Is yeah, yeah, exactly. The whole point was just to make a mockery of the people that copied them. But then he became like a fan favorite, because he is really charming. Wow! If you touch that thing, it fucking grabs you and takes you into the box. It's fucking scary. What a fate. You must live forever in the box. In the box, I cannot die! Oh, can play a song! Canonically, the only ending that Crash has in which Crash is not seen either dying or saving the world <laughs> Excuse is me. the classic uh, Jack in the Box ending. If Crash gets stuck in the box, he becomes a. It's like I have no mouth and I must scream, where he like can't die, but he keeps getting more and more disfigured. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely the worst fate you could possibly have in this game. Didn't they make and, a and, game out of that and, fucking story? Out of what? I have no mouth and I must scream. That was a story. Yeah. Oh. Did they make a game out of it? I, I could have sworn there was like a weird like. Who has no mouth? Uh. The the whole point of the story is they they're just like living in some giant machine that's like. It, it won't let them die, and it's, like, kind of keeping them alive, and then in the end, the guy gets, like, turned into, like, a weird slug. Where did this story come from? Uh, I think it's, like, Harlan Ellison wrote it. It's the same guy that wrote, like, A Boy and His Dog and stuff. Oh. Sorry, man. All I know about is J.K. Rowling, and that's it. <laughs> I've only read one book, and guess what? It's I, the Bible. It's, yeah. <laughs> Jesus was the original Harry Potter. He was the original Horcrux. Okay. <laughs> Jesus had Horcruxes? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I Dozens of them. That. And Leprocruxes. That's fucked. Yeah. Nah, he was a bit of a goose. But, you know, they don't they don't bring up that part in the goose book. Oh, God. You're pretty good. I know. Dude, someone should remix that. That would be a dun, epic dun, 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 dun. Oh my god, I'll get that fucking thing. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> what Fuck are these you boxes supposed to be? That box looks like that fucking like infamous uh, red-haired feminist lady. <laughs> Who's, Who's that? that? You yeah, remember yeah, that yeah. one? It's like, would you shut the fuck yeah, up? Shut the fuck up! Yeah, with the fish mouth. Yeah, she's a cartoon character. Yeah. She is the epitome of the Karen archetype. Yeah, I feel really bad for people called Karen. I know a really nice person called Karen. Yeah, me yeah, too. I, I guess their parents couldn't have fucking predicted like that yeah. far, and you know, like obviously no one's gonna then call. Then it their... would turn into a slur, like akin to like, I don't know. Look, I've been saying that white women need one for them for a long ass time. <laughs> what was the man version? But isn't it kind of a shame that it had to be a real name? Yeah, a little like, bit. It's I mean, a shame I, I for... even feel bad for Chads to some extent, like actual <laughs> Chads. I always thought Chad was a really lame name. Up until yeah, it was a cool thing. All the more reason to feel sorry for them, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah, good point. Because their whole life they're like, huh, Chad. My name is Chad. You think and, Chad sounds dorky? And I the people use my kinda, name as an insult. I mean, it doesn't anymore because of the Chad meme, but. I always would associate yeah, now Chad Chad's with. Chad somehow like... become like a strong name because of the meme. <laughs> See, I would have associated it before now with like a surfer dude or something. Oh, my God. What? Chad? Yeah. Huh, I'm like Chad. Oh, you're right. Dude, bro, I'm Chad. Dude, bro. Dude, bro, I am Chad. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my dude, bro. This level feels like it belongs more in Rayman or something. It's really weird. Yeah, a little bit. What's, these are all ghosts doing all this? Uh, yeah, just like the government. Oh. Oh. Uh, so you're telling me the government is ghosts? Uh, that's what I've been saying for a while. Well, yeah. I but guess that's I... believable. I thought we were all in agreement that the government was ghosts. I specifically don't agree with anything. Okay. It's so I can come off as like cool and opinionated. Remember? <gasps> that was really good, Lyle. Yeah. Good timing there. I, I have my Stubbs moments. the zombie. Okay. Do you ever play Stubbs the zombie? No. I, I remember good? the title, but that's all I remember. Mm. That's kind of mean. Someone this worked really the, hard on that. That was like a weird era <laughs> of games where there was like... Oh no, like... wait, I definitely played it. It was an N64 game, No, it right? was Xbox One. Oh, it was, it was an X Xbox original. What was that era trying to rip off? There was like a weird era of game where like they... It was like mascot-driven games where they were like... It was kind of like Destroy Humans or though, right? weird or... 
There was there was Stubbs the Zombie. There was like Voodoo Vince. I remember that. There yeah. was Whiplash. Do you remember Whiplash? Yeah, I remember that too. I think everybody. Yeah, they all wanted to create franchises when but you do something like that. What was the template? You know uh, what I'm saying? Like, what was the template for like gross little character like that? Maybe platforms. Conquer. Yeah, I don't know. But even Conquer wasn't that successful. I, I'm trying to oh, think of like Peru. of like what would have inspired a lot of that. Like, was what was the really successful like ugly character design that made everybody else, well not ugly even but just like weird character what design? What came first, uh, Psychonauts or Whiplash? Uh, Psychonauts, I think. Uh, I feel even, like it was Psychonauts. Even Psychonauts, wasn't that kind of a, just a sleeper hit at the time? Was yeah, it? I don't think it was, like, huge, huge. Oh. Like, that game is a cult classic, but I don't think it was, like, super successful or anything. What? I would hate to be doing that to him. Wouldn't you hate to be a human cannon head? Yeah. And your only purpose be to, like, scoop up strangers and fire them? I remember there was this old Merry Melodies thing, you know the Disney shit? Yeah. Where it was a bunch of orchestra instruments and they were all like, they all had faces and shit. It used to freak me out. I don't know why. Here you go. <gasps> wow. Level over, we're done. I feel like what I was supposed to do for that was listen to the music and time my shit accordingly. Really? I think so. There, there were like levels in Rayman that were kind of like that. Oh, I like those levels in Rayman. Yeah. Ooh, abu, abu, abu. <laughs> yeah, they had like Black Betty. They had a. Uh... Did they really? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. It's like not the actual Black Betty, but it's all the. It's it's like the instrumental of Black Betty with like, Ooh, abu, abu. like like gibberish in front of it. Yeah, it was it was weird, but they they were really cool levels. Dude, you're right next to Dingo Dial. Oh, I can see him strip, dude. What? I could see him strip. I can watch him strip. Oh, there, uh, okay. You get I guess, to play as him. Guess I'm him now. Wow. I guess this is my life now. <gasps> I can't wait to see him. I can't wait. I can't. Wait. I fucking love Dingo Dial. <laughs> so is, it's like an Australian themed bayou. Is that the idea of Dingo Dial? Apparently. Oh my god. Oh, crikey! I'm starved. Wait, is that? Roadkill pie. All I've eaten shit was got hit by a car and such. The character animation I do think is still really great. I think so too. Well, man, what have we got here? Me own restaurant. <laughs> a restaurant based on me. Just conveniently. <laughs> oh, he's gonna fucking get off of my lawn, these fuckers. Oh. It's like Blink's the Time Sweeper! Cool! It's like the gravity gun! <laughs> Jump on a TNT crate! What am I? The Bandicoot? <laughs> <laughs> please, Lyle, please laugh with me. <laughs> what the <laughs> What was that? That was a death, I guess. Dude, please suck in the boxes. It's way more satisfying. There you go. I'm gonna take this with me. I'm gonna shoot that guy. You motherfucker. Where is he? Yeah. I would never fucking traverse this to go to a diner. Well, that's because you're not committed to the gram, my friend. I don't even want to walk a minute down the street to get anything. I would cross the world to take epic pictures of trendy food for the <laughs> gram. Ah, oh, he saluted before I'd, he died. By the way, I had no idea Dingo Dial was going to be a playable character in this game. Dingo Dial is a brave veteran. I thought Dingo Dial was a bad guy. He was. Probably still is, I don't know. Do you think he's going to see Crash and be like, Ah, oh, we had some good times and now we are friends. <laughs> oh, I am glad that we, are, we become friends since last we met. We are equal. <laughs> He's probably gonna say something like that. Like, I don't know, that I'm was... failing. <laughs> or Crash is gonna be a customer. Yeah, none of this be... sounds so strange. <laughs> <laughs> Lyle, please watch out for this guy. He shoots you. He's a fucking pain in my rear. I know. Bitch. Feels good to murder other people who try to murder you first. He feels a little bit weird to play, but I kind of don't mind it. No! Bastards. What? Wait. Can what? you say that? Isn't this a game for babies? What did he just- Yeah, did he just say bastards? He just said bastards. What the fuck? You can't do that, man. That's really, really, really bizarre. 
What age rating is this? I don't know. I can, wasn't can you expecting say bastards now. In in things for children, I I I'm not sure. You're telling me they can say bastard, but they refuse to say the Squidward. word. <laughs> really? <laughs> you heard it here, folks. Tomar's pissed. I'm not. <laughs> no, stop. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. That's crazy to me, though. Yeah, that, I I didn't expect to hear that. Dude, I, is that gonna piss off a lot of parents? I don't know. I almost feel like this make game. Sure, make sure you tell your parents and see engage their reaction. Uh, tell your mom on this game. <laughs> I I almost feel like this game isn't even like well, it's made is it really to be child friendly, but I feel like it's aimed at people who played the originals as kids. No, dude, Crash is child friendly. Well, he is, but I, I don't know. I. I it's weird. It's a very weird line. What is this game rated? I want to look it up. I mean, yeah, if it's T, then I feel like Bastard's fair game. Yeah, and I feel like we could have had, like, a little bit more, like, asshole in this game, you know? <laughs> like, just a little little bit of one, you know? I, I, you know what? If it's T, why not? Yeah, just have, cra wait, wait have Crash pull up his track pants and go, Oh, just a little bit showing, whoa! Is that too much to ask? Crash oh. Bandicoot 4 has swearing. Yeah, I guess it does, but why? Dingo Dial says bastards, Tana says hell, and Cortex says damn it. Is the game rated T or, or E for everyone? Let me look. Crash Bandicoot 4, age, rating. Uh, it's for 10 and over. Okay. So everyone. So it's E10? Yeah. So a 10 year old can hear bastard. I suppose so. Okay. I mean, they certainly can hear it. No, I thought it was supposed to be like a... It's like it's an inaudible frequency to them. Yeah, I thought it was like Westworld, where if they hear <laughs> if they hear a word, they just say, oh, "That doesn't look like anything to me. That's blank. <laughs> that doesn't look like anything. That doesn't to sound me. like anything." You know what? Bastard shouldn't be a dirty word. No, I, I, it's really stupid to consider it. It's one. a very old-fashioned term, anyway. It comes from a time where it was like a dishonorable thing to like, like have not been born with a father, as if that was anything you could help. Yeah. And now everyone's doing it. Yeah. Game of Thrones was the first time I ever saw it, like, used in a proper context. Oh, like, just as, as anything like, other than like just the, like, bastard. Like, the literal meaning of like bastard. Like, they're, they're, they're being so horrible to Jon Snow just because he's a bastard. That was the first time I was ever mm -hmm. like, oh, that's why people get mad at it. It does, yeah, I guess it does do a good job contextualizing that whole idea. Well, Whoa! That was kind That's of cool. cool. Yeah. Was that even necessary to do? Or is it just like an optional thing they let you do? Is it ever necessary to blow up something like that? Why'd you do that? Or is it just fun, Tomar? I didn't mean to do it. I didn't mean to. I swear. I prefer it when you mean to do things, honestly. Yeah, me too. Do you think Dingo Dial is... Uh, what? what? He nailed you. You can get that you in the That seemed unfair. Air. I don't think something that's like a chimera like Dingo Dial would have any chance of making it to heaven. I'm shocked that... <laughs> yeah, no, I'm, I'm kind of... It's sad that Cortex and Dingo Dial don't get like little devils that bring him down. Yeah. Cortex for sure would go to hell. Yeah. If Cortex would go to heaven... It's just bullshit. Also, Dingo Dial is committed what I'm sure is tantamount to murder, so... I don't know why he still gets to go. And he's an abomination. Yeah, he is definitely <laughs> he's like... A, yeah, he's like any chimera is an abomination unto, unto his holiness. <laughs> uh, remember that episode of South Park where they say cartoons are... Real? Are, yeah, they're real. Does that mean that they get into heaven? Yes. I don't know if they're good. If a cartoon's good, it goes to heaven. Yeah, that's fair. But if it if it's bad, it goes to cartoon hell, where it is reviewed by the angriest critics. <laughs> the angriest Joe. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, that guy! Drop it, dude! Ah!